<laughs> I got work, dude. Welcome back, everybody. I said, let's try this again. Hold on. Now we're talking. Yeah, welcome back, everybody. We're going to do a double header. We're going to do some PC builds, and then we're going to go over to uh, start over on official on uh, console. What's up, everybody? I gotta go stop the train real fast. What's up, Lucas? We got Monkey, we got Torka, Clips. Ugh. I almost hit that. I think we can land on it and stop the train. Yes. Turn oh. This is really hard to land when it's going high speed. And on the turn. Come on, come on. We just gotta tip forward to get that speed. Oh we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Land it. Jump. Goodbye, helicopter. Uh-oh. That was the helicopter, wasn't it? It most certainly was. We'll turn this down a little bit. How's my volume? Good? Bad? Otherwise? Alright, we're going to have to uh, slid on the trains. Um, is it train? Right? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, I there we go. Got it. Now I should stop when I jump off. How's everybody doing? We got Link Stinks, we have Sebastian, Slime Time, Lucas, Monkey, Phantom Games, we had Torka. What's up? How's everybody doing? Okay, so I, there was a couple like modifications to the bilge. Um, I, I think it's going to be called the Bulkhead, the new one. It's made for some bigger teams and some a bit more coverage. Yeah, the new furnace UI? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Runaway train. Okay, so I've been cooking up some stuff here in the uh, in the valley. 
this is what we've come up with. This is what we're going to try to hone in and get it step by step. And then we're going to try it over on the console side. It's a bit like the bilge. Exclamation point bilge in the chat. Boopy little boop beep boop. So I thought we would uh, experiment with this a little bit. See what it's like. This is above water. This would go one and a half. So this would be about halfway up or a third of the way up in the cage. And I'm going super fast. In the water, right? And obviously that twig would be stone. So here's the, here, let me just give you a rundown. So you'd be in here, you'd be underwater, then you could swim up like this. Uh, we have a nice platform to put a turret. As we found out, that's definitely a thing. Hot. You come up here. The bilge is like this, it's just smaller. It doesn't have like a, like a shooting floor necessarily. I mean, you can shoot from the top. It's just not super crazy. Um, I think we'll put some boxes here. Not sure if we're going to go eight deep on this one or what. Uh, TC's back here. And then the triple furnaces for the jump up. Bing, bing. You've got storage back here. Right? Haven't put boxes and stuff in there, but you get the idea. A weird corner. I think we're going to put something like this here. Um, this seems to work quite well. We've done this in the past. So if anybody's camping there, right? And we may get rid of the slanted roofs. I, I For some reason, I like it. I don't know why, but I do. It's a fortress. How you like that? Woo whoop. This also keeps people from camping on the underside, but like more importantly, we got a way to shoot down if someone's like under the lip, and then they have to come up for air eventually, right? So check it out. So you've got this on the shooting floor. This will be boxes. Uh, you've got some lockers here. Oh yeah. You've got a spawn point here. You've got lookouts here that we can really catch somebody coming around the bottom, right? Hot. Then we've got. I don't know. We're still working out the back corner. And then this is the same thing, but we're up a bit higher. Right? And then this one is in the right position. Look at that. Look at the look at the range we have on this, dude. It's silly. You can actually take these out of the socket as well. Yeah, you've got crazy coverage. So if somebody comes up on a boat, just blop, blop, blop. And you might end up taking this out, but the, you would put in the ladder hatches like if you signed out. Or you could just leave it. I mean, people would just be able to kind of knock things out. So then you could put stuff like a garage door and stuff in here. By the way, I'm using an admin mode that would be very similar to, or if not identical, to what we would have on custom servers. So I don't have any crazy mods or anything put in here. So, you know how we have like these crazy super stacks and stuff? What's up? What's up, Off-Road Jeep? What's up, man? Russell Sanders says, how's it going? It's going great. Thanks for asking. Lucas says, yo, it's a fortress now. He goes, the bilge got modified into something more nice. Well, this will be a complete... Its foundation is still like bilge-esque, but um, this one's going to be called Bulkhead, I think. So we're going to try to iron out. We're going to try to do this in stages and kind of have it mapped out a little bit so we kind of know what we're attacking and how many materials we'll need. Because as you know... We did a different build on the last stream, and it was good, but it was kind of a lot of resources, especially if you're starting solo. This is more meant to be like, look, you're either starting as a solo or a duo, and you're going to add people, or you just stay solo. So I think this one's manageable. The footprint's rather small compared to the other one. The other one I feel like was on the threshold of being too big for a solo. Um, but then you can start to add things like these different floors as you start to go up. Like you would obviously start with... You know, you'd stop on this floor and you kind of, you do the pieces you can afford. You've seen us do it before with the bilge. And then as you get more money, you can kind of push up to the next floor. And then by then you should have enough resources to really do the more sophisticated build, which is these weird undershoots. Yes. Perfect. Oh, yeah, yeah. So then once you're up here, forgot to do the rest, um, you can jump up again. Whoops. Yep. Yep. And then this is your... Uh, see, I don't know if this jump up is what we're going to keep, but I'm just kind of kicking around ideas. I don't know if I like this particular kind of jump up, especially with the door the way it is. kind of hurts my feelings, to be honest. <laughs> it hurts. Yeah, that's a hard jump up. Anyways, you jump up here, and there's the top. And then you've got, like, a rooftop, rooftop. And more importantly, when we have minis, you can park one up here. Just saying. Just saying. Just putting it out there. It's got a garage potential. Here, let me... Sh you know what? We don't have a garage built, but you can see how easy it is to land up here. Well, let me just put it this way. On PC, it takes some skill to get there. It's not hard. It just takes a little bit of time. 
um, with the mouse and keyboard once you figure it out. But I honestly think once we do get minis, whenever that is, not that it's soon or anything, um, I think us using dual analog sticks for the PlayStation or Xbox are going to be so much easier to fly a helicopter. I think it's going to be as the same type of controls here, but like think about it with analog sticks, it's just so much more uh, analog. You know what I mean? It just I don't know. It feels like it's right for a helicopter. So I think we'll pick this up a lot faster than PC players did when it first started. Is basically what I'm saying. But there are a ton of super skilled pilots on PC. Don't don't get me wrong. Don't get it twisted, dude. They'll fly circles around us right now, but. I just think initially, um, yes, everybody's going to crash, but um, it's going to be, uh, I think people will adapt to it much quicker. So like landing like this was super hard on PC initially. Ask anybody that's joined us over here, they know. But like, I think doing this kind of landing, because this is considered fairly narrow, uh, especially if you're starting, but, ooh, look, <laughs> ooh, I'm looking bad, boo, Jade, boo. Just saying, it's got the capability later on. And we have some extra room for electricity, which is going to be coming sooner than later. And then if you hold uh, crouch, you actually can drive it on the ground. It's control on PC, but that would be B for us. And that would be, let me see if I can remember the layout. I, I've had PlayStation, I've played PlayStation a long time. I can never remember the button configuration. The one off to the right, is that... I want to say it's circle. Don't quote me on that. PlayStation players, help me out. I gave my PlayStation away a long time ago. I actually bought it specifically to play the Destiny beta. Oh, did you see um, Bungie and Sony are now in bed together? Hey, that's cool. You know, I like Bungie. I do. Kind of wish they'd do Halo. But Destiny's kind of become the new Halo, hasn't it? Hope we get neon signs like PC. I do too, but I don't think we will for the same reason why we don't have billboards or signs or anything. Because they need a system in place for both platforms to like regulate that. Like I said in Forza, uh, when, when the community gets a chance, all they're going to do is draw dicks. Um, myself included. It's just funny. I don't know why. Pen to paper, dicks. Neon signs, dicks. I don't know why. Anyway, um, got a little distracted there. <laughs> Is it circle? Okay, good. Th like, I, for some reason, I keep second guessing myself, and I always like switch it around. Same with the, uh, the right bumpers and the trigger, right? For PlayStation, I'm always like, and then the push and down the thumbsticks. I'm like, which one's R three? Which one's two? I always talk myself out of the real, what it really is. Anyways, um, so stability was a bit crazy out here. So I think doing this, we might have to maybe whittle this down a bit because stability is extremely low on the top. So maybe we do take the slant off on some sides. I'm not sure yet. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It does provide some honeycomb on the top, so we can make things like this metal. Um, See, so I don't know. This will either be another build, and then we have the bulkhead, which is that bigger one for like a trio. Which is good. I don't know, guys. Um, nautical terms? Anybody? I'm open to ideas. So basically what I'm saying is the bilge is its own thing. I think the bulkhead is what we built uh, the last wipe, which is like a, a beefier for like a trio duo. Um, the footprint's larger, so you definitely need some farmers to help you out with that one. You could do it solo, but it's pricey. Um, but I kind of want this one to be its own thing, too, because it's footprint sets. Actually, let me throw it down on the ground. Duh. All right, let's start like this. What's up? Jade is cargo. No, not yet. We're hoping next week, and it's going to be on PTB first. And then after it cooks, it will be there for roughly two to three months, and then it goes to main branch. Typically, if things go as planned, things can definitely change. Uh, if there's instability, kind of expect a bit more time. Doesn't It doesn't mean it's certain, but like it just it's, it's, a, it's a moving target. Let's put it that way. This is essentially... The one we're looking at now is that's it. Just stand in it so it makes more sense. Scale, sense of scale. So it's not terribly uh, bigger than the bilge. Says, do you have any tips on base building, especially console? I'm pri I'm primarily a solo. I don't really know how to build 
a sustainable base against raids. Uh, I usually build 2x1s and 2x2s. I would normally tell you to do the arrow, but since the drop boxes are glitched, the arrow is essentially a a vault mechanism where you have to like respawn inside. So, and you pass things through the wall, you never actually break it. Can I play Rust on a laptop? Uh, yes, you can. I would check the minimum requirements and go to recommended. Okay, so there's like minimum requirements for PC, then there's recommended. I would shoot above recommended. And I would even go and check the forums of like, uh, or even, I'm sorry, Reddit, to see what other people are getting for performance for um, something in the ballpark that you're getting. That's that's how I would do it. Um, yeah, because it, it, it's moving all the time, like as far as what's required for this. it's Unity is kind of a hog. You see all that drama with Unity recently? I was like, huh, weird. Unity. Yeah, so basically the arrow's broken until they fix drop boxes. The arrow base. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I would really like electricity badly. Okay, so we would start kind of the same way we did before. Ooh, here's the other thing, too. Let's see what our cost is, our upkeep. I feel like this is a nice in-between, and it gives you the verticality you're looking for. That's just me, though. Uh, let's see what the cost is. See, it gives you a bit more foot room, too, right, on the interior. Put some bags here. You can stick some in front. You can stick some, or one on the triangle, another one here in the other triangle. It's not terrible, right? Like, you can squeeze some dudes in here. Now, what we've noticed after living on the water for a little while is you definitely need to kind of live or uh, run some some wood around because you're going to need it on board because it's much harder to get to, right? Because you're out in the middle of the water, essentially. Oh, wait, we're going to check the build cost, or the upkeep, rather. Sorry. There you are. So, seven and almost a quarter, so we'll just call it, we'll just round it up. We'll say it's eight stone nodes. Uh, two metal nodes, and what, a tree? Eight stone, two metal, and a tree, right? So you get 16 stone nodes, you could get two days, so you might have to put it in a box, because obviously I have super stacks there. <laughs> I wish we could stack them that high on, on traditional, but that would break the game. I, uh, actually, um, crazy Albuquerque, there is a streaming gaming option you can do it on your Xbox. I think, is it GeForce Now? I think that's what it's called, NVIDIA service to do it. And I think you could do it from a laptop as long as you have a decent connection. I don't know. I would, I would explore it first. I don't know how good or bad it is, depending on where you're at, like connection-wise. Anyways, that's not terrible. If you're thinking like a duo trio, this is, this is definitely ob obtainable. And then as you start to add the floors, you can start small, and this would be much, the upkeep would be much less. But then as you add the floors, hopefully you've got enough resources to keep yourself going. I don't know. I think this one's kind of nice and cozy. Right? And then if you notice, like, even when the whole server got raided, notice nobody really messed with the water base, did they? They did not. And this does run in a little bit of water. We tried it out. Uh, you know what we didn't try out, though? We didn't try it on console. Like, look at this. I'm pretty sure we can get this one right. Yeah, see what I mean? Like, it's up to its neck, dude. That's crazy. It does not go into water, though. At that I do know. It's uh look up Sir Winter's uh one door base. I think it's like sixteen rockets of stone. Nice. Yeah, Sir Winch is a good builder. There's so many good great um content creators in the Rust community, dude. From console to the PC side. Staples in the community that have been there forever, new up and coming, some people that are just good movie storytelling. It's it's yeah, I mean I'm sure you guys know. I'm sure y'all know. Oh, you know what? Our stone cost would go up, wouldn't it? Because we didn't make these stone, do we? Way to go, Jade. You messed it up. Yeah, one thing we're doing in here is we're adding more supports. And then we probably put cages on the bottom. Kind of keep people off and away from the foundations. And then you would eventually make these metal. And pretty much everything's an exterior piece. That's really hard to get to. Uh, oh. I had it for a second. I had it. Oh. oh my goodness. There there we go. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, let's see. I'm trying to think of another base build that you could use. Usually the arrow is really good for solos because it's cheap. But since that mechanic's broken right now, it's you literally can't use it because it's a vault. Um, I guess the... I mean, we're probably going to do a setup here. We've been doing this small... I don't know what we're going to call it, but we've used it the last couple wipes. It's like a very small bunker made for solos. And, like, you don't need a garage door. It's quite nice. Can we just... Yeah, let's just throw... Uh, you know what? We'll throw one up here. Don't know what we're calling this, but it's super cheap. So you start off like this, right? Boom, boom, boom. Get the time code. Come back to it later. Alright, so you would start off with, like, I don't know, 4 or 5k stone, if you, if you are that lucky. Right? And you start off with, like, a, a crusty door, because you don't have anything. We're just going to use wooden code locks for speed. I said everything. I feel like we need boxes. We do. Okay. So you start off with, like, a little bit of stone. Once you have this down, you place your tool cupboard. Pretty standard stuff. Lock it. Throw some crumbs in there if you got them. Right? And then, like, the first thing you do is try to make your door. Actually, before I even put the, the tool cupboard on, you know, let's start over. Let's make this real. Okay? Okay, so let's say <laughs> it's starting over. <laughs> Time code now. For reals, now. All right, so you come out here like this, right? In panic, because you can't build that fast at Coffin, not like you can here. You make this stone quickly. You don't worry about the top yet. You stick your door on and lock it because even if somebody takes this over, you still own the door. Chances of them coming and TC griefing you this fast are pretty slim. Unless you're streaming. Then you place your tool cupboard in the back, knobs out, click it, put some crumbs in there, click, 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 click. I really just try to put a door in there. I don't, what am I, new? Then you can put the roof on. You, if you can afford it. The next move is to come out here. And then place this. Um, if you are uh, experiencing a lot of heat, you can place a door frame here, but only make it wood. Do not upgrade it. That way you've kind of got an airlock for a little bit. If, you, if you're under extreme attacks, like if you're in the heat of it, because that can happen. Like if this is wipe day, things get a little dicey. Right, so then once you've got this, then you can craft yourself another crusty wooden door, which I currently don't have open. Way to go, Jade. I thought you were good. Okay, then we're going to place this here. And I guess we'll have it go inwards, and we'll place a wood lock. That way you've kind of got a miniature airlock. Then I place my sleeping bag, usually by the door or in front of here. I don't really know yet. Probably right here because it's kind of out of the way. And then you say it's like inside. <laughs> I'll catch up on chat here in a sec. Just doing like what? I can't spell, dude. This is the bunker we're gonna do to start a base like that, or the bilge. You guys have seen this before, but somebody's asking about like a halfway decent base to kind of keep you going. Who was it? Uh, Matthew. We got you, dude. Okay. So the reason why this stays wood is you're actually gonna hack this out with like a, a hatchet or a sword. But anyways, okay. So like right here is gonna be the bunker portion of the base. Let me go ahead and move my stuff down. Trying to think of what else I can kind of throw out of here so it's not as crazy in our inventory. Okay, um, so this way you've kind of got some a start. Then usually what I do is I'll place, I'll go outside, like so, and get my shelf put in quickly, like this. Am I crazy leaving doors open? What are we rich? Place this here. Try to jam as much as you can in there, whatever you can. Then make sure you delete these. You don't want someone sitting on your roof door camping you. Now, is this invincible? No. Can someone flame raid you? Yes. Would you sign out with this? Heck no. You got to make sure you've got metal up at least in the core. Um, it's, it's not going to stop everybody, but it stops a lot of the grubs. Because if you sign out, there's usually a sweep of dudes that come by with flamethrowers. I mean, talk to me, chat. You know, it's happened, right? And then, so usually by now I've got enough to make one of these. I've usually ground up enough metal where I can make a box. Hopefully I've hit the outpost or fished enough where I can get this. And I usually just place that on the interior. And I kind of just, I live out of this. I, I cook stuff while I go out and farm. If I've got some metal, I put it in here, even it up, and then, uh, you know, just go farm. 
And then what you want to do, as soon as you've got metal, you want to replace this door with a dublé door. Double door skin, anyone? You know what? I'm going to put this up in chat here in a second. Remind me about the double door skin. So this way, um, all of your important stuff is behind a stone wall, and it's at least four satchels to get in. And then this kind of baits people into maybe Flame Rager base, but it doesn't really count. All right, so you're out there farming. Your thing's cooking in here. Let's just go ahead and simulate this real fast. Cookity, cook, cook, cook. Yeah. Right? So when you have one furnace, you want to make sure it's always burning and cooking something. And you usually want it to be metal and not sulfur right away if you're solo. You need a place to stick your stuff. All right, so let's say you got another batch of stone and some wood you can use. Go outside skinny. Place this one low. Place these guys high. Like this. Uh, make that stone. And this way, it's kind of like this is going to become your new airlock. Soft side facing you. This is really going to be beefy here in a second. So, like, what's going to happen here is this is going to be how you lock it off. And you can already see why uh, the area that's highlighted here, we're going to actually hack that out. But let's go ahead and make our next uh, piece here. So, this is going to be your new jump up. Seal this all off. And yeah, it's cheap. But, like, this looks poor enough that most people aren't going to mess with it unless you're really pissing people off, which is fine. I mean, just know that's what that's what comes with it. <coughs> Sometimes you got to do it. <coughs> Roasted almonds. Okay. What I like to do here is if you're poor, which is usually all the time, I usually put a wooden door here until I can afford it. And then out here... Um, there's a reason why we're doing this, too. I make these wooden frames um, because you might hack these out and make them into garage doors later. <coughs> but we need the swing action now in the airlock. I do make this stone on the top for both sides. Then I put up another batch of wooden doors. I have them go inwards, so you're creating an airlock. This way it kind of baits people in, right? So they're like, oh, look, this base is trash. Or to the bigger people, they're like, hey, this base is trash. I don't think I want to raid it. So if anybody flame raiding, they're going to come in here and then hopefully get stonewalled by your actual metal door downstairs. But anyways, okay, so let's say you have all this. Um, the next phase here, if you're going to make the bunker, uh, it, it's really important if you have a bunker to make sure that you've got a, a bag on the inside or you will fail. You will actually lock yourself out of your base. Uh, you can do a long sword, salvage sword. It's actually super, super cheap. If you hit the soft side, let's say you take this door off. I deleted it. But, like, you can hack these up pretty quick. Yeah, see? Look at that. It's 10 per slice. As long as it's on the soft side. So I'm just going to finish the rest. So what you're going to do here... I hope this is for you, Matthew. Soft side facing you. Half wall, soft side facing you. Go to this one. Delete it. Make that stone. And now this spot here is going to turn into your bunker. I guess you can make that stone, too. But, you know, you're, it's like... You don't have any money, so <laughs> usually I upgrade that like way later. All right, so this is how it's going to work when you seal up your bunker. You're going to take your soft wall and face it away from you. You're going to place your triangle here, and then with the material that you, you can afford to lose, you seal it here. And why this works is, as long as this is twig, stability for this floor piece that we just put in is 31%. It's all being held up by this because these foundations here, oh, I'm going to fly through it. These foundations here and here, you can't attach ceiling to foundations. So the only thing holding it up is this twig. So when you spawn in here, you take your rock and just slap this and it opens up the mechanism. Pretty standard stuff, but like this is like to do it on the cheap, right? I know this isn't earth shattering for a lot of people, but some people it might be. So what I like to do here is, since you're going to need to build and put things in, I usually put a box here. Actually, yeah, it's a box first because I can't afford a freaking uh, a barbecue right away. That's metal, man. What am I, made of money? So you would put, like, I don't know, 500 of this in here, like 200, right, to seal it up. I'm just trying to keep it realistic. And then you would put blueprints and a hammer in here. And then as you can afford it, you're going to put things like metal and stuff in here. You wouldn't put that much. You'd put, like, maybe 150 or 125. So then you would seal this up because you always are spending it every time you place it. I mean, I've got to spawn more of these. I didn't really think it through. Where am I at? Uh, construction? Hello. Tools? Hello. Uh, hammer. Yeah, so you can kind of see why. And then the only time well, I you have to have a sleeping bag in here because if you don't, you're in trouble. But that way, because um, you're not going to have a garage door, right? And it, metal is so scarce, especially if you're building on the outskirts if you're solo. So you really need to like do the best you can. So a lot of times uh, when I've got this bunker mechanism good to go, or if you think you're going to be farming longer than 30 minutes, seal your bunker. 
seal it. Let me show you again to make sure. When you place your half wall down here, do not upgrade it. If you do by accident, break it immediately. The triangle gets upgraded and you're good to go. So like if you're going to go farm, seal up like this. Um, so let's say you have enough metal now because you've been cooking your furnace for a hot second, right? Cookity cook cook. Or you've, you know, ground up enough. You're going to want to place a metal door here. That way, there's two things deterring people. The, <laughs> the wooden doors for most, for most people. The wooden doors basically say you're not worth raiding for anybody that's got the cheese. Uh, and the solo locks here also go, oh, this guy's solo. You know, maybe we're not going to raid him. But, like, even if somebody comes by that's a piece of trash and wants to flame raid you, they're going to spend all that time flame raid this and go, oh, I don't have cheese for that. And you be like, yeah, that's right. Okay, so let's finish the jump up here. You can either um, place this here and then place a half wall. And then I would upgrade this because most people, and only make it to wood, don't make anything else. Uh, soft side out. And then I guess make that wood too because you're going to make this honeycomb later. But like that way you can jump up. Um, a lot of times I'll do it kind of in the back here too. A little bit. Like this. Sometimes. It just depends on what's going on. If you're doing this on the water like we did before, I know I'm a little scatterbrained, uh, a lot of times I'll face it towards the ocean, like the jump up, so people don't really see what's going on. Most people just kind of cruise the shore if they're roaming and they'll be like, ah, this thing's trash. Because let's be honest, to somebody who's got the cheese to blow a wall clean, they're going to look at this and go, yeah, it's not worth it. Unless you give them a reason to, right? Like, you're really pissing them off. So this is what this is the layout now. You're still cooking metal as, as best you can. Uh, we sealed this up because we're quote-unquote farming. Uh, you're going to be cooking stuff, adding more shelves in here. As you get your first workbench, you're going to slap, slap that bad boy back in the corner. I kind of like to do it in the corner corner because that way you can kind of pick up your... Uh, furnace. So if you get uh, enough low grade, you can put another furnace in. I would really suggest cooking metal as much as possible because you're going to want to like upgrade the interior of this at some point. If you only have two furnaces, it's going to take a hot second. So like initially, you're going to want to make sure these are going to be metal uh, down the road. So um, you're collecting more wood and stone. So this would be like the first phase. Let me go ahead and stand here so you guys can see it. Blah. That'd be like the first phase you want. Right? It's like enough protection, and you look broke enough, and you, you technically have roof access, and it is two exit points, so it gives you the bare minimum, and look at the upkeep on this. It's nothing, dude. Which is good, because sometimes you got to sign off, you know? A lot of people work, man. Look at that. Not even a stone node, a tree, and a metal node. Uh, cr some crumbs. You're good to go. Nice. Matthew says, this actually looks super promising. What you can do is, whenever the stream's done, it automatically goes to a video. That's how YouTube works. So just, um, it always goes in, like, my stream category. Like, I've got, like, a playlist for it, so it goes there automatically. You can always come here, and it's on, like, the front 40 minutes of the thing. And you can, like, even type in a comment, and then do, like, if this started at, like, 30 minutes, you can put, like, 30 minutes colon zero zero in your comment. So then that way, you can just click on your own comment time code, and it'll jump it right there. So, hey. Eh. A little tip. So, like, this is the first phase, right? So, this is typically where a lot of people are going to end up. Sometimes I sign out like this because you're like, hey, that's all I got. So, again, if you're going to go out farming, seal up your bunker the best you can. Always close your door. Make sure you got a sleeping bag. Uh, you're cooking more stuff here. We're going to simulate more cooking. Cook. Yeah. And you don't have a garage door, right, because we're poor. Then what you want to do is you're going to farm and you're going to be placing... Uh, honeycomb, and this is going to be stone honeycomb, around your base. I'm going to make these wood just so you guys can see it better. Like, I'm going to upgrade it. And that's why we upgraded that one. Uh, these wooden triangles are going to be honeycomb, stone honeycomb. And I'm going to give you a top down. And it's like, you know, when you honeycomb that, as far as, like, materials cost, not the twig, but, like, the wood, you're going to make that stone. So, like, for a solo, that's a lot. So, you, you really need that to be in the second phase. So, and especially if you're going to be building or upgrading uh, where I'm standing right here, because uh, that's the TC. Uh, if you're going to upgrade that to metal, you want to make sure you're wrapping it in stone so you still look poor. In the Straits of Dire, if you can't find stone, which is the situation, you, on these wooden uh, plates, the uh, triangles we have around here, the one, two, was that four? <coughs> oh, it was almost five. What you can do is uh, you can make that wood. It's not the best use of your wood, but like if you let's say let's say you upgrade this core piece here to metal, 
you need to make sure that it's wrapped because then if somebody's coming by and they've got a little bit of cheese and they're like you know a zerg or like a smaller group they're gonna go oh hey let's pop that they got something worthwhile because that's metal so whenever this turns into metal you gotta make sure you wrap the outside with something Re and you really want to be shooting for stone initially because that's the best use of stone you don't want to be wasting your wood because you're gonna have to do a lot of cooking right like you gotta do poor man cooks because you know that's just that's how it is all right, so let's do these little upgrades. Let's say you farmed it, right? So you got this one here. And you would chop that wood down like we did with the wall. I know it's like super easy when you're an admin to fly around and do that, but like as far as translating to getting shot at, Zerg's taking all of the materials. This is a good phase um, to kind of like stop and start into because you, can, you just don't have this kind of money right away, especially if you're fighting for it. Because when you're solo, man, when you get popped, like, you don't have somebody to go get your loot for you or help you out. You got to, you gotta like, salvage your stuff. You know how it goes. How do we do the other jump up? I forgot. Uh, did we just leave it on the lockup? I think we did. I think, I think we did. I'm trying to remember what we did. Um, so we're going to knock this out. We're going to make this stone. Just remember, you got to make another jump up. So this way you've got the whole area wrapped at the top here. So hopefully by this time you've got enough to maybe make a uh, another square up here. Even if, like, let's say you don't have enough to even make uh, the cube back here, right? The one I'm standing on. Because, I mean, I, I play like that and I was like, I just don't have that kind of money. A lot of times, sometimes you could just make this wood, right? And this will bait people like crazy. You guys have seen it multiple times. They'll be like, oh, look at this poor guy. And then usually that um, the wooden double door we had down here, right, that we replaced, I usually stick it up here. That way they don't know what's going on. So, like, if you were to upgrade your core, they're not going to know it's all metal. Whoops, we left these all wood like an idiot. I'll show you the cost of the base, too. It's actually it's pretty cheap still. So, like, even right there, you're like, oh, that's that's nothing. Exactly. All right, so, like, right here, you're going to make a jump up. That's going to be a triangle. Oop. Kind of sticking out. And then just make it wood because people are going to knock it out. And then if you're trying to run home with a payload, you're going to be like, what? That way you can kind of, like, jump up quick. If you need to, you can jump, uh, you can make a jump up on the other side. Eventually, you're going to make, like, a a doorway or an airlock here, but like this will be your next phase. A lot of times I'll just stick like a fridge in here and like we'll be fishing off the back or something. So like when you get all those extra seeds, you just throw it in there with a the lock on. It's so funny, like when you sign back in, you'll see all these doors like burnt off and then you'll see this door still here. And even if they blew this off, they'll stop right here and be like, yeah, uh, you know, FML, like what am I gonna do, blow that up? I don't have that kind of cheese. So let's go ahead and look at the upkeep, it's still super low. Look at that, one and a quarter nodes for stone, a tree, and still like just crumbs, not even 50 fragments. You can grind up water jugs and do the upkeep for this. You don't even technically need to mine it or smelt it. Cheap. All right, and this will get you going. So like what you do here is, um, we'll say this will close up phase two. What I like to do here is when I have the metal, an excess amount of metal and enough to actually do the upkeep, I will do these first. That's it. I don't even mess with the foundation right away, right? Because you've got these, these honeycomb pieces really blocking you. So you're good. And then you can't even tell that it's got a metal core. Right? So look, we've upgraded this. What is that now? Not even. Uh, not even 150. One and a quarter stone nodes. Not, not even 150 fragments in a tree. Right? And you've got like super, super protection. So for someone to get to your core, they're going to have to slap a metal wall, which is expensive. Right? And if they go through the doors, they're going to have to burn this, blow this off, which is four. Then they're going to have to blow this up, which is going to be, what, ten. So you're looking at fourteen satchels, and then another four to break the door. You're looking at eighteen satchels to get in here. Then if you get more metal, then you start to metal off uh, more sections of your core here. See, look at that. No double door, or no double doors, no uh, garage doors or anything. Oops, I guess that's not accurate. Hang on, let me, let me upgrade that. Oops, I had bad numbers. Now let's look. Yeah, still not even one and a quarter. 1.1, right? So 1.1 node. Let's call it 1.2. Let's call it one and a quarter stone nodes. Um, 
almost a third. That'd be a third. Yeah, 150. A fourth of a metal node and a tree. Right? So, like, you can already see with those low numbers, you can keep up with two furnaces. So you always kind of want to make sure you're feeding it something and you keep your wood supply good. For This is, like, from experience of just playing it, right? And then as soon as you get the money, you can put more boxes down. You know, get silly with it. Put them in here. But you see how that top part's, like, just basically camo for... It's poor people camo. It's awesome. Or would it be rich people camo? You, you get you get what I'm saying. And that's usually where it sits. And then we usually make the core here metal again, and then we place another like building top over it. And a lot of times this will just be all we really use. And then like we'll build a couple of these sometimes. And then this will be on the shore, and then we'll start to build stuff like this, or the bilge specifically the bilge more in more recent times. Bam. So I always try it on PTB first, uh, so you're good building it. Yep, 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 yep. So you kind of just get the flow of it. But, like, I, I'm i trying to go through and also tell you, like, some of the gotchas as you're, you're actually doing it. Yeah, because it's completely different when you're, it's only you and you're risking everything to do it. A lot of times I tell people to have, like, stashes and stuff. So, like, before you start to build, have a... Have a sleeping bag on the beach somewhere. So, like, if you do get racked, you can at least see what's going on. Have one that's in the blue, not orange. Hang on. Da, 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 da. There we go. Then place a couple stashes down and, like, just throw your extra materials in there before your base is done. And then only take with you while you're building, like, what you think it's going to take to do those different sections. And then that way, you know, as soon as you've got your interior, then you can, you know, dig up the stash and throw everything inside. That way it's like if someone pops you, it's not completely over necessarily. It's a good way to start. It'll get you going. I Literally, we're going to build this exact same thing when we get started. <laughs> and we may only get enough materials to just do this to start for the stream. Who knows? Matthew says, all right, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. No problem, dude. So it's probably like from 25 minutes to about 45 minutes in the stream. See, when it's done, just make a comment that says like 30 or 25 dot or colon zero zero and then space and then put like, what is it, 45 colon zero zero. And then on your comment, you can just click on it. I'll take you right to it. I would say make a clip, but those are only a minute long. Yeah. It says, when is Cargo and L96 coming to testing branch? Most likely next week. Now, it's still up in the air. If they run into issues, I hope, uh, it's cool that they're going to tell us when it's coming, but I hope they tell us if it's also been slightly delayed too. Like, communication's good. Save it to my playlist. I'll go back to stream. Nice. Okay. There you go. Okay. So this is the one we're going to start with. So it's very similar to the last one, the way we kind of start. You know what's crazy, though? Hang on. Where was the TC on this? Where did you end up putting this? Was it off in the... Side piece? Just trying to get my bearings down here, right? I think it was like right here. Then I guess we could do a boathouse off of here. Maybe. What direction do we want to sling it? It's kind of dope to have it like that, right? Is that four? One, two, three, four. Let's see if that works. Ooh, not really, right? Because it needs to, like, come in on the straight side. Hmm. This is why we're here. It's just, I don't know, it's faster for me to do it like this. I know I don't like using this big, bulky spot, but I guess it's unavoidable. All right, that could potentially be a boathouse. Maybe. I'm just sketching it out, taking a little look. Those, uh, the middle and the right, the triangle is going to be the TC, I believe. 
And then that square is going to be the entrance for the boathouse, potentially. That could work. Yeah, because if these are going to be the doors here, right, and these become walls, then that would definitely work. Although I wonder. Now it would have to be like this. Have to be, right? Yeah, so I guess we're going to put these kind of things here, and then maybe this is always going to be a double door. Maybe? I don't know. Let's see what that looks like. I feel like we can make that better, but maybe not. There is some weirdness to this because it has to stand up on stilts. Yeah, that, that'll do it. What's up, Mr. Russo? I want signs in the water. That would be dope. When custom servers come out uh, for console, can people own their own servers? Well, you pay for them, like um, uh, da, 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 like uh, DayZ or Arc. What's up? Looks like huge balls with a teeny weeny. Yeah, dude, it's a chode. What's up, Grouch? What's up, girlfriend? It's a chode. The chode stool. Yep, that's what this one is. So if we were to build it off the back here, it would be up in like... Uh, let's, see, let's see what this would potentially look like. Oh my goodness, so many things broke. <laughs> Gotta be careful, it's literally, there's so much stuff. This might break some stuff on top. Maybe. It's actually doing pretty good. So these would become like vending machines under the water, potentially. That was scary, dude. That took up the whole bottom. Ooh, you know what's crazy? We're going to have to place... Oh, no, it let us. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, we'd have to break it. Nice, okay. We didn't. Perfect. And then this would become... That's awfully tight. That's what she said. <laughs> and really, these one of these could be a door, or both of them could be a doorway, to be fair. All right, we were talking about that last time. I thought it was pretty, pretty hot, actually. Yeah, it could be. You know what? Let's do that. Advancements in science and industry. The trick with this is to make sure it swings open where you have enough room. I think like walk through even though it's a little awkward on the inside that way like if we make like a cage floor here the cage fight I, I, li I like the idea of being able to stand here when we own it and then people drown under there <laughs> nobody can come in here and then you can just be like I'm fishing if somebody comes by you're like I'm no longer fishing you can just go right inside this would all be underwater, by the way. This is the boathouse. It's so funny. We always end up keeping a boat indoors for, like, emergencies, and we steal the rest. Hot. I like it. I like where this is going. Yep, this is just like the other boathouse. Nothing too crazy. Triangles. Plop. Plop. Uh, uh. Man, that's such a fickle placement. I 
Let's just see where it sits on the exterior so we got a good idea how this is going to play out for us. For us on council, we got to place the walls last because that procedural cut only happens then, unfortunately. So hopefully, so I'm assuming that this wall facing here faces the shore, right? Like this face. Then everything else will be tucked behind. So like the boathouse is back here. Let's go ahead and make that official. With the rolly ball on the inside, lock it up. Then you would have wooden doors here. And you're like, hey, Jade, that sounds crazy. But think about it. Who, you can't shotgun it. You can't flame rate it. This is all underwater. So you'd have to use satchel charges on it. And then right here, you would have like a double door. And then as you can afford it, you would have a garage door. So this is a, like a giant underwater pocket. And then when you can afford it, you just upgrade to, what are they called? Vending machines. And if you need one way out, you can just leave one of these doors, I guess. Then you've got extra storage for your boathouse. Don't forget to turn off your broadcast. And yes, you can place vending machines underwater. I guess you could make a store and bait people in. That would be kind of funny, actually. We're going to put this all underwater, too. It's just we're trying to work out some of the kinks. There is a slight build order. It's not terribly complex. But um, it's very similar to the build in that regard. Oh wait, we didn't put, we didn't put a metal door here, did we? We got it all dressed up. It says, you gonna be sexy and get me wet? It says, you doing some electric tonight? I mean, I could be talked into it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so the beauty of all this being underwater is it's it's super hard to, to melee something out. And then hopefully by then you've got enough materials. This is a little costly, but... And the reason why I make these doors is because sometimes you don't want to always have doors in here. That way it protects your foundations from getting meleeed. If someone's going to put, like, two air tanks on them to melee out your foundation... Seventy-five wood a pop and seventy-five metal fragments. This will be later because you know this is pretty costly. So that way, when somebody comes, they can't like stand on anything. There's cages around the whole thing, so they have to swim the entire time or drown. That's rough not having a door back here, huh? You know what? Should we make this? Eh, I'm looking at it. Should we put a door back here? I kind of feel like we should. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna we're gonna put a door frame there, and then we'll, we'll put one here. Yeah, I like that. We'll flip this, right? Yes. Here's why: because if somebody blows the door, the wall still stands and gives you the support, right? If someone's going to blow a door, they're going to go into the next thing and not blow the frame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like this. I like this. This gives us some stability on that side. Yeah. Hot. And we can come through on that side. So the beauty of this is you can enter and leave your base and nobody will see you because you'll be underwater the whole time. Especially if you got that scuba. You can be on this floor and then walk yourself around. And you're in your own like little moon pool down here. And the boat sits right here. And then you go glub glub underwater. You can put like a garage door when you're rich. Live that good life. Oh, go underwater. Right here, that's enough time for you to not drown. Come up, get shot by shotgun traps. The shotgun traps would be... Where's our jump up? Is it right? Oh, it's right there. Yeah, we can still place like... Oof, that's so dirty. Oh my god. As we've seen and we tested, this is brutal for anybody trying to enter. And I mean anybody. OK. 
kind of a rough entrance. We might want to clean that up. Boom, you're inside. What's up? It says, uh, I made it to the stream today. What's up? Apothic Flame. He said, do we? Always. What's up, dude? I don't know how I feel about this slant on the second floor. That gives people the ability to climb up if they've got a boat. So I don't know how we're going to do that. I, that'll be something we, ex whoops, we can experiment with when we're on an actual server on the console side. We're going to probably build this like once or twice here, maybe in some chunks. I'll take some screenshots so we can remember what we did. What's up? He says, got it looking good. You like that? I know at the very least we'll get the little bunker going. If we have enough materials, we can start to build this. Alright, so I think we got what we're looking for for this. So we're going to... Okay, got it in my head as, as to how to do this. Uh, uh, okay. If my fingers would just follow... Yeah, it's almost good that there's doors there because it, it baits people into taking the door out, not the frame. All about stability. It does look like a chode. Yeah, so the bottom portion would be facing the shore. Masi Menos. Welcome to the schnitzel piece. What's up, chat? What's up? Oh. Okay. Uh... So we'd start like this. This could really not even be there for starting. starting. These would just be like frames. Like this. Right? And we'd just be going around doing this. Perfect. This is where the TC is going to go. So you're going to have some stilts here. Uh, cargo is coming to PTB. It should be next week if everything goes as planned. Probably make this stone first. Yeah, you would. This is where the TC goes. Yeah, there's something about it being on the water that really deters a lot of people. Which is great. That's what we want. Excellent. Um, okay, so you would start like this. Our jump up would be, that's a good question. Where the heck is our jump up? Is there a jump up in the back corner? Yep, that's in the back corner for sure. What's up, Chad? Yeah, I think it's, is it here? Hold on. Yeah, it's right next to, is that right? <laughs> I 
What's up, Kyle? Says, hi, chat. What's up, Jay? Thanks for streaming. What's up, man? I've been daydreaming about this all day. Yeah, I think that's going to be the jump up, right? Because that side has to be... Wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, because this is the hole, and then you have to jump into this triangle, and then you've got the platform. Okay. I see. I'm. This is why we're doing it, man. I would have messed this up so bad. Okay, so since this is the jump up, I guess we could work in uh, the halvesies here. Not that I've thought this through yet, because I haven't. But then we could put these supports up now. Oop, because when you're in the water, it's a lot easier to do this. There you go. And then you can just, whoop, you can walk it. Dude, am I bad at jumping or what? Is that this? That's not half is it? Am I that bad at jumping? My goodness. Here we go. Got it. Pfft, I'm bad at jumping. News flash. I can't read or jump. Whoop. It's pretty easy once you've got one frame you can walk around. Perfect. The trick with this is you need to make sure the floor's down first. We're standing on the on the floor level. Bingo. It says, uh, I love the drawing board phase. I do too. Working it out, you know. Well, it's like uh, this. This came to fruition actually last night because I thought I was going to stream last night, but I couldn't. So I was messing around with this. Says not too much. I uh, can't game right now. I have control problems. Ooh. Should build a pen. Yes. Controller problems. So up here, this will be where the TC is. So if we we're really like getting shot at and stuff, we would actually we'd be placing it like this. And it'd be walked over to the corner. Once on the edge, walk to the corner, lock it. You know what? We should just put the whole stack in here, shall we? Really, I just tried to do that. That was dumb. Alright, so you'd start with this. And if you're really getting shot at, you would just, you know, get yourself a, a frame. You don't even need the rooftop. You put a duble there. You'd pretty much be safe. Alright? Right. Then, we're going to try to get the rest of the floor because you really need to, do, at least on our version, you need to make sure you get the floor tiles in. And honestly, the other one had all triangles. This one's got a couple of squares. Kind of makes it a little bit easier, to be honest. We should be able to wreck this one. Yeah. And we're going to place a frame here. Perfect. Triangle, triangle. Beautiful. Then, I would probably try to get some of these guys first, which is expensive initially. You should try to do like every other. So if somebody comes by and decides to be a free control, you can kind of handle. I'm getting this one all stuck because that's where your walk-in is. Now once you have some of those main supports up, you can kind of go around and uh, stone the rest. The first floor and then work the second floor. You just swim around and do this. We'll put one in the water too. Oh, we didn't get this one, did we? What am I doing? 
guess she can make this one stone now. Okay. Then, um, I guess she would have to make another jump up. Oh, you know what we forgot to do up here? Ooh, big steps. Forgetting them. Yeah, put this up here, man. <laughs> Wet. <laughs> Is the next wipe a BP wipe? No. No, it is not. I'm trying to think logistically. I guess we would leave this down. Because how else would we get back up to do the upgrades? Yeah, so this is actually going to be a freaking halvesies for a minute. This is literally the only way we can get up. Anyways, uh, once all those are done... As soon as you can afford it... And since your shoreline's right about here, you want to put maybe some of these bad boys up. Yeah, because your shoreline's like about here, right? On the bottom of the screen. Yeah. Hope I did this right. We'll find out soon. Now that you have the floor and you're going to be doing the jump up, you can get this out. You won't be able to delete it by then. You're going to have to pike it out. Uh, all right, so the trick with this one is you're not actually using roof triangles. You're using roofs. And you only use, is it four? There's one. There's two. Here's three and four. Bingo. Now, if you upgrade these to stone, bam. So now you should be able to swim in and up here. And now, uh, on this side, this is a little tricky. This is going to be your platform section. Then I'm going to place a wall frame. Give some more stability. You can only place it there, as far as I know. Oh, wait. Word? Hold on a second. Is that for real? Did it let us place that for a minute? Hold on. It did. I saw it blue. You guys saw it, right? What? That was weird. I was like, yeah, I'll, get, I'll take more stability. Sure. Or was it back here? Anyways. Um... So now we'll have, whoops, did not know it was a no clip. Alright, so this is going to be our jump up. We're going to encase all of this. Put a temporary wood shield here. Ooh, does it not let us? Word. Okay, have these. And we're going to make a wall. And we're going to delete this. That'll stick. Is it really being difficult in the back side here? Oh, Oh, because we don't have a frame here like an idiot. I was like, <gasps> it's going to break everything. To chat with you guys later, I'm uh, going, going to give my dog a walk, and I like the base building. It says, i got to try it out and build it on, on uh, Builder's Paradise. Yeah, do it. I guess we could try it over there too, but I kind of want to just get in on the wipe and check it out. You know, test it under fire. Okay, so at this point, we should have, oh, we, we should have a roof on, but we don't. That way, at least you can swim up, right, and do some stuff. Probably by now, you don't have enough metal yet. Well, maybe you do, if you've got the bunker outside, I guess. You got something like this, maybe. This way you can like swim up. You've got a little bit of protection. People on boats can still kind of come by and skis you real bad, but it's like, even if they take this over, it's like, what are they going to take? You know, your dignity? Maybe. They might, they might actually take that. Perfect. Perfect. 
They really just seal up the top as soon as you can. At least get the not seal up, but get the the walls up. And then if you've got this is twig or whatever, you can kind of just still look over the edge and catch people slipping. Usually by now, if you've got a little bit of metal, the best thing to do is to make that metal before you do anything. And when you do, then you can place your actual frame in here. And you can seal it up. Alright, isn't this the jump up? I want to say it is. I believe it is. It is. So, as you start to get more Furnacios... What's up, Richard? What's up, B? That way you've got the ability to get up. If uh, you got to put a single door, you can just kind of do this and jump up. Okay, so I'm still a little iffy about how this is going to go down here. I feel like we can maybe utilize this space better. I'm definitely open to ideas. Originally, I was thinking we could stick a locker in here, like lean into it and grab. I was like, we could also fit like two extra boxes, so probably not worth. Ta-da! <laughs> Would you rather put a door first or TC? Ooh. <laughs> Sometimes door, if if there's like people creeping, door and a lock. That way it's like if they're going to play that game and they take the base, you still own the door. So you can still kind of like play games like that, mess them up. Good question. Which uh, I think every scenario has happened so far, so. I I feel you on that, sir. Yeah. Alright, so these would turn into loot rooms. Come on, quick. Yeah, because these phases, I think, are pretty realistic because by the time you, <laughs> you, like you come up here, this is a considerable upgrade, especially if you're still rolling solo. And then I kind of forget what we did in this section here. I'm going to have to go over and look. Because it comes up here, right? Oh, it splits. That's right. We've got the storage across, which is a little wild. We got that weird bend. Okay, that's how that's how we're gonna do it. But okay, I forgot. Trying to utilize the space the best we can. We might end up making some changes later, but I think this is decent. Then this way, if we kind of have it like this, we could put a door here. What do I have over here? I think it's a wide, it's a frame, which is not bad. Oh, no, it's not. Isn't this the, um, it's a regular door, isn't it? I want to say it is. That actually works out pretty well. If it sits, oh no, no, it is a frame. Okay, well, I guess they both work, don't they? Wait a second. So it goes, no, it is a frame. Dude, where was I? Not? Was I up one floor? It was. Okay, it is the door. <laughs> Hello. Glad I checked. That's cool. You can move up one of your uh, wooden doors from downstairs because you're probably upgrading these slowly as you go. 
And then if this is going to be a rooftop section, that's pretty good. Since I always run solo because I uh, can choose what to do next and what's important in my opinion. Nice. Trev says, hi, Jade. Looking good, bro. Thanks. Says, can PC players still use neon size as one-way mirrors? Uh, I don't know. I don't rightly know. So then as you can afford it, uh, you're probably going to cap it first. Right? Like stick the roof on and, and whatnot. That way you kind of, it's like a, an airlock for your top section for your jump up. I guess if you can afford the metal door over here, I would do it. <laughs> but a lot of times you're kind of just moving the wooden doors around. This would keep back some scrubs. It's going to come out all this way in flame, flame raid too. And by then you should be hearing or seeing them. And you can usually deal with it. As for my reference, hold on. Because I thought I was like, oh yeah, I got this. And I'm like, mm, maybe I don't. Is that, we won't have time. We're going to be getting shot at and stuff. Know what I mean? Everyone flirting with you tonight. He says, you know what the boys wanted? Or he says, you know what the boys want, don't you? Yeah. Thick, greasy hot dogs. Am I right, gentlemen? Is that what you guys want? Greasy hogs? You're like, yes. Now, the other stuff is so freeform. I'm a little shaky on it, to be to be honest. I want to say the sweeping part is these guys here. Let me check that. I think that's the shape, isn't it? Or does it go further? Oh, no. It does go further. Is that right? Am I crazy? Does it swing all the way in the back? Hold up. What is the jump up? How about that? Okay. It does. It wraps all the way around. We're going to make this high quality so we can just tell the difference. Interesting. Uh, just looking at that shape, I wonder if we can't clean that up. Yeah, that's why we're here. I really want to do it in on a live. You know what I mean? I'd like to feel the fear. Alright, so this will be the jump up for the next floor. And these will be triangles. Perfect. And you kind of have a shooting floor now, right? This is facing the back by the water. If you need to, you can stick a furnace up here or something, and you can kind of jump and be like, pop, 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 pop. You've always got the option to spawn in your bunker and shoot from there. Like, that would be on the shore. And let's say the actual water line would maybe represent the road. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I still feel like that's too tight. Do we really have it that close on that side? No, it was slid up. That's right. This is where the door is. Man, I would have messed it up so bad. I was going to say, because that, that had like no room on it. Well, one of my reference images is incorrect. Out or in? Out? Mm -hmm. 
That's right. Maybe. Dude, you can't even see that freaking furnace. Excellent. Really, you can make this whole thing a jump up almost immediately. That's not bad. And you've got these goofy triangles you're going to slap up here eventually. We're going to build this one more time in the water and see uh, our execution for that, if it's uh, flawed or not. Man, placing these triangles are so annoying. You're like, I have to almost fall off my rooftop to place it. You almost want to... Do you want to be up here to do it? I guess. Regular roof tiles. <laughs> oh, you know you want to place. Come on. Paste it. Upgrade it. Upgrade it. Upgrade it. So it says, does Rust run okay on a mid-range laptop? As long as you're hitting recommended, I guess you can do minimum, but it's going to be a rough ride if you're on minimum. Requirements. <laughs> So we've made a couple tweaks to it. I might have to take a leak. Give me a sec. Herb. Play some transition music, yes.
Hello, Medicated Kid. Thank you for the super chat. It says, hey, Jade, finally caught you a, caught you on a stream. Your base build kind of looks like a grain silo. It does, doesn't it? Call it the meat silo. <laughs> That's what we should call it. Here, I'll keep this going for a second. I got to check something. Do you like the sunrise? Was it pretty? Thanks for waiting. <laughs> What's up? Okay, let's get the last leg of this here. Yes. I kind of like this because um, when we have it set up, like, like y'all. Wait, do we have? Yeah, yeah, we have it as a jump up. I'm wondering, uh, we got to see how this is capped off. We might. I, I'm playing around with these plugs here. I don't know which one's going to be the best. To be to be fair, but uh, this is nice. Like this is a good phase to stop at. You can load these up. Oh, you know what though? We still have to. Oh no, you know what? We can make shelves this way. I'm just trying to think. Um, because making scaffold on the outside <laughs> is not something you want to be doing if you can avoid it. There we go. That way, this can place our uh square tile right there. Bingo. And then you would just kind of leave a lip here. You jam a couple boxes back here and stick like a small guy in in between. And then uh, I think it would make it nicer. And then you can kind of jump up into the shelf if you need to. We'll see in practice if that's any good. It may not be. So the whole idea with this is you don't really have honeycomb. You're on the water. And so you're going to upgrade your outer walls um, when it's pertinent, when it's feasible. What's up? Cargo on console? Not yet. Hopefully next week it'll be on PTB first. You know what I'm saying, dude? 
That way you wouldn't stick any, like, grills or anything in here. That way you can kind of, like, you know, sometimes you got to idle while you're playing Dance Dance Furnace. This isn't a bad place to kind of get up out of the way of everybody. And, heck, if you got the furnaces down here. Ooh, that's hot. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like it. Then you can kind of, like, slink your way out there and be like, you know. Ooh, I like that a lot. And then we can just, we can put a garage through here. Let's say we find one. We can really get silly with it. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Oh, that's hot. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're getting there. Yeah. Perfect. And then you can play Dance Dance Furnace all day. Woo! Alright, so if you have more of these guys, I would recommend, at the very least, this will stop anybody camping that door. <laughs> Give them a little surprise. If they're waiting there, you open the door. Wow! I guess you could do this. Um, there is a bit of a gap here, but we have a larger gap. Um, the procedural tiles here have a massive gap on stone. Kind of gives you a, a peak ability, this outer wall, so it's not terrible. Um, if you want to stick boxes here, you totally could. Like up on the frame here, but you might want to leave a couple gaps so you can see around. Entirely up to you. I kind of like the gap, to be honest. That's when I start. Oh, we blocked ourselves. Look at that. Don't know how this jump up's gonna work. That's pretty good. And then the next one would be the shooting floor. <laughs> Hot. How did we set this up? I feel like having a, a wide door there might be a bit much. So a single to a wide. Okay. That way we can kind of work this side. Let's see how that let's see how that plays out. What's up? Is Craig on PTV yet? No, not yet. Uh, we were hoping it was gonna be this week, but it looks like it's gonna be next. Fingers crossed. Is that right? Do we have it like this? I think I put yes. Well, this isn't bad. I kinda like this. You can like come out the back and be like blah blah blah. Ooh. Then maybe we just leave it like this and then we'll maybe do the top piece later. And just figure that out. That's kind of dope. Not going to lie. I like it. Then you have some verticality. Uh, I think we put the shelves in. I don't know why I keep hitting tab. We put the shelves in over here. Lou says, sweet. I know, right? Excited for it. Yep, we did. And then lockers, and then this is the floating portion above the bottom here. These are going to be tricky. Um, this one's probably the quote-unquote easiest. These are going to be rough. You're going to have to, like, yeah. Like when you're not flying around. Yeah, so like really, you could, yeah, the interesting thing is, which way do you put this, huh? Mm, I guess like that, I guess. And then we'll put a, uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da Yeah, this is all doable, man. I like this. I was a little bit worried about how the execution for this, these two last two floors were, but it's actually not bad. I can see us doing this with with these. Are we going to do it one sitting if it's just solo? Probably not. We'll probably do it over a couple of days, but I don't know. It just depends. If we can get like a jackhammer going, then we can do it one sitting. Nice. Dude, we got some verticality now. My goodness. Kind of wait on the boathouse because you kind of want to get more of this. But this is a good stopping point initially. And then you can add that shooting floor a little bit later. Did I even do that right? I feel like I got a big old gap right there. Now that's what comes out, right? It is. Okay. Maybe we shouldn't have placed the boxes. Hold up. 
We got some supports that come out over there. Deet, deet, deet. And maybe it makes more sense to, for us to make that slanted part different next time, but... Yeah, because we've got a support beam that comes out right here. We're going to have to do that in the interior. <laughs> Boom. Is this PC? Yeah, for right now. Um, we're going to switch over to the uh, console here in a little bit. We just worked out our bunker situation. This is where we're going to start on the shore. Then we're going to go out into the water and do... I don't know. What what are we calling this one? Maybe we just call it the silo. What is something that's vertical that's on the water that's nautical, whether it's an oil rig? There's a ship that goes vertical, that sinks and goes vertical. I can't remember the name of the ship. Okay, so let's take a look at our setup here. So we have the brake coming off of here. The two brakes come off of this back piece. Let's go ahead and take another reference photo for ourselves. Okay, for me. So just kind of play with you on console. Uh, whenever we have our custom servers up, you'll be able to join an event server, and that'll be the best place to do it. Or when we do one of those events on an official server, which doesn't always happen all the time, but it does occur. You'd be like, thanks for nothing, Jade. All right, let's figure out the shooting floor so we can get it done. Okay. I know. So one of the flat pieces will be here. Wait, did they both come off? So square, triangle, and then the break piece. Is that right? Yeah, this is the separator, and this is... Yeah, that's going to be tricky. Okay. Yeah, definitely need to make sure. Because, you know, you don't want to be messing this up while you're out there in the wild, dude. It just gets too crazy. I feel like this side will come together quicker. So the trick with this is you need to build up supports. And I did this all flying as an admin. So the real question is how doable is this? Oh, not too bad. Okay, doable. Uh -huh. Not too bad. Not too bad at all, actually. This has to be this. Oh, 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 it. The trick is to offset it. Oh, is that right? Oh, yeah, that's hot. What's our stability? Eight? Ugh. This should stick to the frame, though. Um, quarter, third, break it. Oh, yeah, it's floating, baby. Nice. We got it. That's not, dude, this side's actually not bad at all. We got it. All right, this and then this. If stability is correct. Ooh, that's not bad. We'll flip that, because if somebody's here, we don't want them to jackhammer that. We'd have to go down and up again, but that... Dude, that freaking works. We don't even have to put the extra supports down. Kind of hot. Now, the real question is, how bad is... Uh, can we put up the rest of this? It's looking like we can. Oh yeah, I think we had this as a uh, like a midway section, so you can put like a locker here. Uh, these these lookdowns are sick. I think it was it was game lights. He's the one that first did that that I'm aware of. Then I think we made a spawn shack back here. Hey, but that's okay. We can put like windows and stuff in. Not a big deal, right? Right. Windows. So let's put the top cap on. Ooh, we're looking good. That's what I was afraid of. Um, that work? <gasps> it does. Ooh. We're onto something. We didn't even have to put the extra supports in, did we? Or did we? Did we? We didn't. <gasps> no way. That's kind of dope. Ooh. 
Wow. It's a lot better than I thought. And if you don't have any window frames or uh, reinforced glass, you can always put the wood in there. And then just make sure anything in here you don't mind that gets stolen or... Because people can kind of look in the window and then pike your windows out or your walls out, soft side it. But for the most part, it's pretty hard to put anything out here, I think, because of the, Yeah, that's why. So maybe they can't. Yeah, because the whole thing is you put some of that twig on the outside and then people, like, just pike their way in. You've seen us do it a lot of times. So if you're going to put something like this here, just lock it, I guess. Then make sure you got a door. I like to stick beds here. This is a good place to spawn in. kind of like to stick it up against the windows, so if the windows are out, you can be like, bop, bop, bop. And then again, Game Lights had a good idea of sticking uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. lanterns right about meow. So your feet don't always dangle down. So like, yeah. You still get a little bit of peak, but that way when you're on the outside, your feet don't drop down as far. Right? Normally, your feet would be where the lantern is. So it's a lot harder for somebody to take a shot at you um, at distance. Hot. Love it. You're hot. What? Shut up. So when is Cargo Ship coming to council? Hopefully next week. It'll be on PTB there first and then cooks for about two, three months and then hits Maine. So it's a ways out for Maine. Sadly. Then we could do the same thing here. I think we can squeeze two of these bad boys in here, huh? Stick the bed board up here. Plop. Stick this against the wall as tight as you can. Plop. Then close to the bed. Plop. Good to go. Then if you're poor, you can go swing doors. That way, if anybody does pike their way in, you're good to go anyways. A lot of times you're just going to stick bars in the windows. Most of the time. I don't know what we're going to do for this. I guess we could stick a furnace. Not the best way to get up, but I guess it'll get it done. Then up here, hopefully if our stability is good, we can maybe, uh, you know... Cap on top. Then you get all the way to your rooftop. Kind of sick. Honestly, with no helicopters, this is kind of OP. Because you're out in the water, so already you're really taking it out of the hands of a lot of people. I'm not saying it's impossible, and no base is unrateable, but this definitely makes it super annoying. Perfect. All right, this back section here is another wraparound. It's going to be a little tricky. So we just have one of the peaks on that side. Oh yeah, I forgot where the peak was already. It says, when do you think uh, the French UI change will come over on PC? I don't know. So we're triangles until this side. Okay, got it. So out here is going to be, so you come out here more or less. Go ahead and stick down our support piece here. Triangles. That'll be the break. Alright, so that's not going to fit. Stability is a thing, so we can place it here. Getting the undercarriage for this seems a little tricky for this one, so hopefully we can get this sorted out. And we'll try this underwater much faster and see if, because um, I think I have most of the process down in my head. I hope. So you could either choose to put windows here or not. Kind of the same idea. You stick a bed off the back here. You put some windows up. You can put the uh, the shutters in. Put them on the inside. And the kind of the same type. You can already start to see, like, you've got a lot of bedrooms and stuff that are really good for your teammates. Do you know what I mean, dude? Where's the bed at? There it is. 
smash this up against the wall. So really, it just gives you more shooting angles, right? Come on, I know you want to fit in there. Flop. And then I would make this like a roller boy if you can, because you're gonna want to be able to take angles off of this. Yeah, I like it. That's hot. Okay, so the real question is, how difficult is this going to be? Right? So really, well, actually, we can place this here. This will help a lot. Oh, that's so good. Uh, That's not bad at all. Hold on. Why did I think that was hard? Oh, dude, cake. Freaking cake, dude. Okay, never mind. Forget what I said. And then make sure the hard side's facing. Oop, did you get it last minute? We did. Good. Great. Place this here. I think that's about right. Get a roller boy over there. Plop. And then, what did we say? Shutters. Do we have shutters? We do not. inside bingo so that way if somebody ends up on your rooftop and they're sitting under here yeah, like yes they can pike stuff out but look like nothing's of import over here and if they hit anything here it's just gonna fall anyways right, and if you really wanted to I mean you're not gonna stick crazy stuff in here but if you're worried about it you can just make it a metal floor and then that's really gonna deter most and then these little shotgun traps sitting up here in the hood. Boom. So, if, you know, because you're going to need this to traverse the outside. If anybody's sitting here, they're dead. Same thing with this. You'd probably make this metal. To, you know what? Maybe we end up changing that in the future, but for now, that'll do. Because your top floor is for, like, you know, suppressive stuff. You're not going to keep, like, your best, best stuff in there. There you go. You kind of upgrade things as you see fit. Um, put your different boxes around in, on the interior. And uh, I think we got it. Put a swing door here if you really wanted to. Bingo. If you really wanted to, you can even slap a locker up here. But if you did, got to put a lock on it. And then if you sign out for the night, just take it with you. That's not bad. That way you can grab something and be like, pop, 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 pop. Because you remember, you're uh, one and a half tiles underwater. So half of this wall down is underwater. Is that a polar bear? <laughs> hey, cutie. So yeah, that's the... Oops, we got to get this one down here. Let's make sure the interior is good. So that's the basic idea. Boathouse would be out here. Still, I get you know what? Let's start off quick. I don't think I need to build up all the loot rooms. You can kind of just configure it the way you want to. This one's not bad because you're swimming around this, so it's super easy to traverse. And for us, we have to place these. First and then the wall because we do. I can't believe we didn't have to place the interior walls on there. That was pretty hot actually. Bloop. And now we can place these guys here. These will be wood because it's underwater. And you can place, uh, what do you call it, vending machines here later, where the wooden doors are. These will be metal doors. Hot. That way you can make it to the next floor. We'll throw up the, uh, what the hell are these called? The, um, 
chain link fence. I was like, what is it? Ta-da. Perfect. Underwater. Come through here. Oh, we probably need to make this metal, huh? Probably. Or at the very least, stone. Then I would say, um, you could probably make this metal. Maybe this one. If you want to go on the cheap. Really, you want to make all of these door frames metal at some point. And then make, uh, your metal walk-ups. The rooftop slant metal as well. And then when you do get a chance, metal up your floor. So that way if somebody gets in, they can't just easily pick their way up. They can stick things like your tool cupboard. Or your tool cupboard. Your freaking, uh, what is it? Workbench. Hello. You know it's crazy. Do we not? Well, you would make this. Oh, it's a little difficult. Hey. Oh, tricky, tricky. Well, looks like we need to make that shelf a lot earlier, don't we? Note to self: make shelf. Then really, as long as you keep the boxes cleared off that back side, you're pretty much good to go. What? Why is that not placing? Hello. Oh, uh, you know what? It probably would place. Hold on. Because I have my sleeping bag there like an idiot. Let's try that again with the frame in. Because I was going to say, I'm pretty sure it places through the frame. So if we place this here. Yes, this should work. Oh, it does. Thank goodness. Okay, we're good. I'm crazy. We'll just throw this in here real fast. <sighs> Could you imagine Daisy would build a building like this? I know, right? What's up, Sleazy Franklin? What's up? As long as this is back as far as it can go, you can like reach into the lock. That way, if your boys come on, they can uh, get in the mix. load this up. I'm a big fan of being able to like sit up and skis in the corner. I like it. Come on, snap in there. Huh. Did not mean to do that. Wow. Oh my goodness, snap. With the shelf in there, that makes it super nasty. I think. I'd probably metal these first. And then the exterior when you get a chance. Just those to start with. Kind of keeps people from popping in. And then as, as you can afford it, which it is fairly expensive to do the upgrade. Um, just kind of pick and choose when you want to do it. And back here, you can load this bad boy up with some crazy amounts of boxes. At least eight, maybe more. And I think the best thing to do is just kind of stack them in like this for now. I mean, technically, you could put a turret in the back. But having eight right here is pretty juicy. Gives you a little bit of room to crawl up into, especially if you start adding more people to your team. I guess use at your discretion. This one's a little weird. I guess you would kind of want to place your boxes here first if you want to go all the way back, if you want to do the grills and stuff. Yeah, because that back piece definitely gets to be a problem. Yeah, see how much further i got to come up with this? Yeah, considerably. But that's okay. You guys get the idea. You can pack your loot rooms any way you see fit. I 
And then once you've got the money, you're going to throw in your level 2 or level 1 back here. And then this is a good place for sleeping bags and whatnot. But it also creates a nice little block for people trying to get in. Yeah. Or you can even put off this corner. It's really up to you. Door frames. It's tough that you can't reach that. Hopefully this deters most. And even if they get in, there's still a lot of banging to do for the rest of the base. So hopefully it deters most. This back piece. Oh, that's the jump up. I guess I could have left that stone, but... Yeah, you can already see. That's pretty expensive, but you do have room for other people, other teammates. Uh, some mobility where you can kind of jump up here and do things. Uh, you've got the triple furnace, so you can really do some bacon. Got some floor space for some more bags. The all important bags for the crew. I, I think we can squeeze three in here, right? Yeah, boy. Hot. And when you're rich, you can always throw up a turret up here, which is really nasty. Always a good play. You can even throw some back here like a complete doucher. You know? It's a thing. You can even compartmentalize more of this, which I would recommend as you start to get gears and more metal. Uh, you can really start to cordon this off. Should be able to place that there. Yep, okay, good. And even right here, at the very least. But again, after the base is like established and you've been doing runs and stuff, it makes more sense to do this because you can't you can't ever just play. You're like, oh, I'm gonna place 82 doors. So that's unrealistic. So you would start with swing doors and just kind of replace them as needed, and then you've got your TC back here. Boom. I don't know if we're gonna call this the meat silo, if we're gonna call this the the bulkhead. There you go. I got a roller boy right there. Bingo. Same idea back here, more room. Bam. Yeah, you'd probably be taking your swing doors up here at this point, but hey, it is what it is. metal all your floors, ceilings and floors, and then this is a pretty good place to like to keep the base. Oh yeah, one more thing. We gotta do the cages outside. I'm just making sure. Yeah, because like this up here would be the same thing as downstairs. You kind of have like a little uh, door action here, right? And we'll throw in these boxes right quick. Oh my goodness, get in there. Oops, I meant to flip it, not open it. You even have more locker room up here too. It makes it real juicy. You can stick it right up on the frame like this. Same with this side. So hopefully you've got a lot of access to dro drop off the roof if, if you need to. Shoot back when you need to. Pretty hot. What's up? You stick more segments here for more doors. Okay, so let's get the boathouse and everything else downstairs. Our shooting floor is looking pretty juicy. I'm a big fan of this first. I like to stick the cages down, doors swinging out like this first. And you're like, why is that? Well, think about it. Most of this is underwater. Right? At least half of or a third of this floor is underwater. And then if you've got good clearance here to stand and not drown, I would suggest putting a floor in. If you don't, just leave the floor out. And if you got teammates, have like two doors that are code locked and then the rest of it is. 
You know what I mean? It's kind of, well, unless they really need it. That way, I don't know, it just kind of gives you a place to kind of sit and shoot. It keeps them from, like, standing and, like, getting their stand back or whatever. Stand. They're, um, you know what I mean? Not stand, but they got to press A all the time to swim, so. If you put the floor there, it kind of helps them drown if they somehow sneak in on you. And it helps compartmentalize the whole thing. I'm a fan. Yeah, so if the water's at a good level here, you should be able to stand. And then you can, like, open the door and fish if you want to off the back. That's definitely a thing. Kind of keeps people off your foundations. And then when you can afford it, you place your cages here. And again, make sure you have at least two code locks so your teammates can get in. It's hard enough to type it in. They're going to have to type it in and go up for air. Because I'm assuming you're going to do all this without scoop equipment. So, like, here would be an entrance. 69, 69, don't tell anyone. I guess if they request more dro doors so they don't drown, I guess give it to them, I guess. Gotta do it on the cheap. That way it's completely, like, just walled off. You can be on the second floor here. You can enter and exit through uh, this little moon pool here, where this is where the boathouse is, right? You can kind of be like, pop, 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 pop. So this will be right on the surface of the water. And then you can plant all your crops underwater, and no one's going to mess with it. Boom. Looking fresh. Looking real fresh. Let's go ahead and check the upkeep real quick. Why low FOV? What? What are you talking about? 6,347 and 2,648 and 857 for the wood. Bingo. We got it. Uh, the cargo ship information is pinned there at the top in the blue box. Oh, you know what we forgot up here? Hello. Yeah. Hi. Bingo. What do you think? Should we try one halfway underwater or should we jump right into the mix? What do you guys think? Because we are going to go over the console side regardless, but. It's actually sticking these little undercarriage pieces wasn't too bad. Not 
at all. Meow, 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 meow. What's up, medicated kid? What's up, dude? This one's gonna be like the bilge. The first two floors or one and a half floors will be underwater. Bop, bop, bop. Yeah. What's up, baby? What's up? And I like these look downs. Dude, anybody tries to drive up on a boat, they can't get anywhere under your base. It's just like pop, pop, pop. Although I guess the blind side's right here, isn't it? Or the boathouse section? Not really. No, you can still shoot him. You see him from back here? I think you can. Yes, you most definitely can. So they really can't hide from you anywhere. It can maybe go underwater and drown. That's about it. And they're so slow too when they when they swim. You're gonna. It's just gonna be like shooting fish in a barrel, quite literally. Literally. What's up? This is when does cargo come to PTB? Hopefully next week. It has a shark tank. Pretty much. Moon pool. I guess you'd be in the water here. You can actually shoot through this gap. Pop, pop, pop. Am I right or am I right? Right. Blitz. I really just got pistol rounds like an idiot. So really, if you put in the metal cages, you can actually wait probably on upgrading this uh, stone section. Bam. It's a dirty birdie. Yeah. Kind of want to go on official and do it up. I feel like we're ready. I don't know if we'll get to all of this. We might. We're definitely going to get to this, no doubt. Should we contemplate life on the train? Make you
I think so, medicated kid, yeah. What's up? Medicated Kid says, you could take the heli uh, with that base, having a base in the water and able to take heli would be a genius build, I think. Oh, yeah. No, I think you can. Because most of this is, like, stacked up. I mean, you have to do repairs just like any other base, I guess, but... <gasps> yeah, so that's the plan. We're going to switch over to the console side. We're going to try to build this bad boy. We're going to start with our bunker on the shoreline. We're going to move ourselves out to the silo, the meat silo, meat curtains. All right, so I'm going to transition over. Hold on. 
So what's going to happen is I'm going to actually let me go ahead and fire this up over here. So basically what's going to happen is you're going to see a privacy screen and then you'll see the little spinny wheel for like 30 seconds or less and then it should catch back in. You'll hear me. I'll be loading in the game and then we'll take out the privacy screen and then we'll be on the console. Yes? Very good. Let me just make sure everything is good to go here. Okay, so privacy screen is going up. I'm still here. I'll count it down when it, it's going to go to spinny or load or refresh or whatever it is. And then it'll be about 30 seconds and then maybe less. Then we should be over there. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I might be. I might have to poop. Poop. Having to poop. Oof. I was like, do I poop? Do we play music and poop? Oh, you know what? Maybe we do. I might have to shit. <laughs> okay, let me load this back up real quick. Wait, am I good? Can I... Mm, Jedi mind trick? Hey. Whew. No, I think I'm good. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, we're, we're going to switch over. I'm going to close that. Okay, uh, we'll count it down, and there'll be a spinny, and then you should hear me, okay? Three, two, and a one. Oh. Oh, baby. You know what time it is. Hello, you guys should be able to hear me again. Hi. We just gotta load in. Okay, give me a second. Oh, I gotta poop. I hear you text. Oh, you flirt good. I uh, know we didn't do. We didn't do any electronics. Boo. Ah. He says, boo, it's cool. <laughs> beep, beep, beat those cheeks. Oh, yeah, daddy. All right, give me just a second. Hello. It says, uh, it's Think about making electri uh, electrical comps in their use, maybe? Video oh, yeah, yeah, no, it's already, some are already in the can, others will be shot. Yes, 100%. Oh, yes. My, my, my. Sweet, that's why I love you. He says, what? Shut up. Yeah. Hey, girl, what's up? No, shut up, girl. What? Mm -hmm. 
Dude, I might have to poop. It's beautiful. Ah. Yeah, the problem is, is that the power search took so long. Ow, ow, ow. I've been dying to put those videos up for a long time. And make some more uh, additional electronic videos. It's hot though. I love it. Eh. What's up? Venom. Exotic. Hello. Well, we might get murdered out here, but that's okay. So I can't wait. Yeah, me either. It's like... But yeah, it's taking a hot second, you know what I mean? Definitely a lot longer than I thought it would. I got the bubble guts, hey! What's up, girlfriend? Mm -hmm. I gotta tell you, this seed looks familiar. Oh, yeah. So I love the field IRL, so I'm super excited to try Rust Edition of it. Yeah. Nah, you're gonna like it. You know, you've seen. I bet those are seeds. Oh. Do you guys like Kern? I love taking these seeds back to the Korea. These guys get plowed already? Man, I hope they use those furnaces. Or, it's already been raided. Hard to say. Oh, stinky, stinky bugs. Stinky. Water jug? I knew it. Let's watch we get murdered right before we hit the outpost. Bam! Let's get the... Ooh, there's a guy right there. Mr. NPC man. Hot. This is, oh yeah, I seen it. I remember when uh, you and BIOS on PC was all that good stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. Try bases and stuff are gonna be so good. I got a baseball cap. Beep, beep, beep. This guy's door blown off? No, it's still there. Imagine. When you'd be able to hit those uh, road signs. I know I want it. This one's looking a little do not feed the bears. Why not? What's up, Kimmy? 
Dude, I'm too hot with that hat on. Really? You gotta run around butt naked? Wow. Oh, That'd be amazing. Pumps and pipes and road signs. Yes. It is amazing. He says, hi, boys. Hi. What? Really, these bums, dude. Right, here we go. Ooh. <laughs> He's just looking at That's so funny. He says, I was having a hell of a time this white finding them. He says, it would have been nice to hit some signs at the outpost just saying, yeah, it is. You're right. 100%. Yeah, 100%. Am I taking all this water? Yes. Am I the worst? Oh yeah. Thanks for the free jug. I used that four thousand or five. Oh, they upped it to five. Hello. Well, well, well. That's an interesting development. Huh. That was four before. Boom. 360 no scope. question is, do we have enough to buy? Well, we're gonna need a sleeping bag, or 20. It says, it was 4k is before. So I like that they upped it. Well, you know what that means, though? That's a prelude to uh, Farming 2.0. That came in with Farming 2.0, which begs the question, are they testing it? Maybe. Quite possibly. Okay, so we have a little bit of metal. I'm not sure how much does 75 and 100. Okay, so it looks like we're buying the pickaxe and crafting the hatchet. Fair enough. It says, uh, do you have a video on farming 2.0? Um, I don't. Wait, I think I have it wh when it first came out on PC. That was like two years ago now. What? Says, or what it entails. Well, it's got T's in it. And T's are wonderful little things. Wonderful. We gotta find a. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, ho, ho. 
What are you selling at the store? Hmm? Yeah, tease, um, cloning. That's like a whole game loop. That's awesome. Cargo should be next week on PTB. Oh my. Oh my. I'll be honest, I might do that level two again. Day. So I, I think if it's probably buried in some live streams, is this especially when they try uh, and try to get the clone right, the right clone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You right, you right. Ooh, look what I found. <gasps> Ooh, look what I found. The deer is just looking at me. <laughs> what? Hey, buddy. So I have a feeling there won't be uh, quality of clones on console to save memory. No, it's all part of it, though. Like, that whole system is tied together, so... You cannot have one without the other. The body cannot live without the mind. Oh my, look at all these nodes. the deer to work. Nah, I'm alright. I'm good, bruh. Is cargo and testing now negative? My precious stone, precious. Rock's like, oh! Pretty small twinkle? Yeah, it's because the sun's going down. Whew. Oh my goodness. Come on.
Okay, I officially hate that tree. That tree is the worst thing. Hi, Randy. Well, okay, now we should be able to make a hatchet, right? Now we should be able to buy some stone, no, not stone, what? Okay, we got about almost 2,000 stone. Oh yeah, we're gonna place another sleeping bag out here somewhere. I had to look. I think we'll have enough to build what we're looking for. Yeah, we should. We'll go from there. Stone? Damn it. I'm like, should we get our level 2? Maybe. I thought this was stone. Toolboxes. Toolboxes. What do you mean, toolboxes? Someone's got their furnaces cooking.
Talking about toolboxes on junk piles? She says, I love watching Rust Council news videos. She says, the one thing I play, I'm most hype about is the community service. Oh, nice. Very hard to see. Ow, ow. Ow. Bots are back. I know, right? a thing. Welcome to the uh, nighttime simulator. Okay. I kind of like, should we put the bunkie over here maybe? I don't know. Seems to work pretty well out here.
They have like just barely enough. Ooh, we're looking awfully exposed, huh? Delicious. You know what? We're gonna plant these because we can. Jake, you need to read the rules of the chat, my man. set up so bad.
places have you messed around with underwater monuments yet? I mean, like the labs? I mean, we do scuba diving and stuff all the time. Balls deep says hi, what's up? I'm talking about fall deep. Ball deep says, Are you using a mouse and keyboard? Chat? Care to chime in on that? Redneck, please read the rules of the chat, sir. What is going on with that base? First rule of Fight Club is don't talk about Fight Club. Uh, cargo should be out next week if everything goes as planned on PTB. Hot l l lunch. Hot lunch. Is hot beef included in that hot lunch? Yes. H always hot beef injections. What's up? Hot beef. Do they have admins? I mean, yes, but they don't. They don't sweep the servers. What's up, Razor? Oh, you know the details. Oh, you know what it is.
Oh, yeah. Well, looks like we're going to kick it into overdrive. What's your ETA? Don't say soon and then do six hours because that's a quarter of a day. That's not soon. Oh, we play like that. You do know what it is. You absolutely do know what it is, Razor. Come on. You do know. Do you need me to tell you what it is? So, I mean, it's hot. Do you need me to tell you what it is, though? Like, you really don't know? That means soon. Oh, yeah. He wants a hot beef injection. Just now I noticed. But okay. Just keep it. No, she's not banned. She gets timed out because she can't. She doesn't know how to read. Or refuses to uh, read the uh, one sentence. Uh, I believe it's the first rule on the thing, but I guess we're the assholes, huh? <laughs> Razor says, keep running those guns. I bet. Yeah, see, Razor doesn't mess around. Oh. Alright, let's go bank this. We need these bad. Well, if Mr. Tube gets on soon, we're off to the races, dude. We can build that meat silo. Hot. That was for Jessica Balls. Balls, balls, ball, ball, balls, balls. Razor, I got a place for us to live out of that's going to be juicy. What time is it for you? Late. Oh, yeah, daddy. Ba -ba -ba -ba. <sighs> Sorry about that.
talk about balls deep. Do I? I didn't put a lock on that other door, did I? I did. How many locks did I make? I feel like I got too many locks. I'm talking about balls to reap. Oh, jeez, Razor. You're toxic, dude. Why don't you get ready so we can flirt in game? You better be Jane your D with one hand and type it with the other. How do you get cargo on console? Uh, it'll be on testing branch. So if you got Deluxe or Ultimate, then you can download Rust uh, Console Edition Public Testing Branch. Separate download. You have to own Deluxe or Ultimate. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Hopefully we got it next week, baby. I'm gonna try to get that level two ASAP. ASAP, ASAP. Razor. Get those little, little sweet cheeks over here. Brace, brace, b -b 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 brace, brace. Razor, you're easy. Dude, I don't leave pumpkins out for anybody. Does it ever use wooden locks? Uh, a lot of keys for obvious reasons, but out of curiosity, do all locks you make work off of one key? Um, you know what? I don't know. Yeah, I just, you never make the key. If you put it on there, you own it and can open it, but... Ba -da, ba -da. I was getting these juicy pumpkins. Blitch. <laughs> Razor is toxic. Toxic. He's toxic because he's not in here. Where are you? Mr. Tube. I got something rather disgusting in mind for this, Mr. Tube. Then the day is mine. All 
Alright, so we're going to try to grab some sulfur and see if we can't get that level 2 and sneak it back home. Toxic! Huh, kids? Mr. Tube, Mr. Tube, where are you? Yeah, I'm so rowdy. Rowdy, 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 rowdy. Database, database, calculating, beep, boop, 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 boop. Ooh, look at these. Kinda wanna run this back home, dog. Yeah, Daddy, you want my pumpkins? I do. Prove it. Get in here. Immediately. There's already some scrubs living in the back half of this place. We'd have to remove them. I don't know what they're doing with the rooftop over there, but... Oh, yeah. Where is Mr. Tube? Not oh, bad, I want to go in there. Yeah, 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 Mr. Tube. Fuck it, I'm going in. I'm going in deep. Balls deep. Send Razor in there with a the Timmy. It's game over. Yes. Well, he's got to be online first. <laughs> Balls Deep says goodnight, guys. Okay. Balls Deep. B -b 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 Balls Deep. So we've got 600, we need a thousand. Then we get that level 2 underway. Alright, we gotta sneak over there, dude. Like a hunk of shit on the roof. Or the top of the mountain. What a big pile of shit. Somebody's like, hey, that's my base. Yeah, dog water. Yeah, monkey loves razor tip. 
Is that your name? Let's go that way around. So they have a chair and a table on the rooftop? That's kind of great. Uh, hey man, has it been 20 minutes? I don't see you live yet, dog. I mean, you can put that in my chat if you're live. You can't if you're not live. You know what I'm saying? That's only for people that are streaming. Razor Temp. You may kiss the bride. Oh. What if I already did, though? Take that repair bench. Watch me. Hey, what is going on with this? Debbie. Oh look, it's Debbie. She's like, I got raided, I'm out of here. So like, get on your feet and rebuild, bitch. Yeah, dog, I need locations. Um, I got you. You can't, I think you already know. It's similar to the, not the last one, but the one before that. You know what I'm talking about? Does this guy always turn off his furnace when I walk by? A little bitch. Jade Monkey, secret lover, don't tell Razor. Oh, my legs, dude. Oh, yeah. So it's for cargo? Uh, it should be next week, supposedly.
Really? Only 75 out of that? For what? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, we're hoping it hits PTB next week. Vibe says, I love you, Jay. Oh, thanks. The Razor. I right, says, so see you guys soon. I believe it when I see it. Boof, boof, boof. Brace cannon. Brace. I better see a notification for that clown. Kissy face, huh? Ugh. Oh, he is live. That little bitch. Okay, we have enough to make the purchase. Or we will when we farm the last node. We just have to find it. Is that... Okay. Can't tell what that is. What's up, sweaty Bill? What's up, baby? Vibe says, uh, bye, Jay. Bye. Thanks for coming by and hanging. There you are, cutie. This is how I love the content. Keep it up. Uh, you inspire me every day. Thanks. Uh, well, I'm glad to hear that. Perfect. Sun's going down. We'll be able to skis our way back home with a level two. Ooh, baby. If Razor and I start going back and forth on a boat, ooh, we're going to be in it.
Oh. Level two, baby. We did all right. Oh yeah, Randy, Randy, Randy. Oh. Uh, when it's coming out? Uh, hopefully next week. I hope so. Oh, I can make one. All oh, right. Is this console? No. Yes. Oh, yeah. Three sixty no scope. What up? We're gonna charge up our health before we make the run. A. Ah, oh, comfort rising. Now with the sword, we'll be able to take out that wooden wall. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm Oh yeah. Oh yeah, charge up that heat. Oh yeah, daddy. Oh, it's getting close, yeah? We'll wait. Says, what is your favorite update for Rust in all history of Rust? Ooh. It's probably a toss up between minis and electricity. Be to be real. Dude, we got lots of good stuff here. If we can make this back home, we are freaking rich. We got a really good start going. I might as well cook some of that uh ba -ba -ba -da -ba, what do you call it? Low grade. Crude. If I can get a couple more things of crude, it would be even better, yeah? Ooh, look at this. Oh my bean can, baby. Okay, you said to meet me at the outpost? Fair enough. I got some kern for him to sit on. I mean, for him to eat? For him to eat. Look at all these bums. Look at that guard upstairs. He's like, I'm just making sure no minis land up here.
Uh, 15, 30, 40, uh, we'll, I, we might have enough if we can burn all this. To be fair. Then we're gonna have enough for a furnace. Oh my goodness, we're so rich. This game gets me wet. Tell, um, can you tell Razor I'm gonna send him an invite to the thing? Oopsie poopsie. Oh. Sorry, I was just getting him in here. I gotta make a poop. from me. I wouldn't mind it. You want to walk me back because I got a level two. Yeah, yeah. I got a rock. I'll defend you with my life. Oh, uh, here you go. Actually, let me give you this. Give me a little, uh, bang bang. Did I stole somebody's repair bench? I mean, we're kind of rich. Let's... Let me give you uh, a cute one. Here you go. Defend me with your life. There's a spear right here. <laughs> to get the spear. Where is it? Yeah, I got it. There we go. Hold on, let me equip it. I will defend you. <laughs> I'll so. slice everybody in the face. I love how people are still sleeping in outposts like a bunch of bitches. I, dude, I want to go up there and yoke them in the tits so bad. Just be like, Pow. I swear, I, I, I'm going to take an F1 grenade and just walk through the door and be like, beep. Alright, we're going to take the rim. Oh. Yeah, it's your favorite place. Bob, balls. The guys that's close to us, they look really uh, impaired. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, so I'm not terribly worried about that. It looks like maybe they were building in dark only. Oh. Yeah, like, they're like, I'll put a slant That's here, good. I'll put a thing there, and I'm like, <laughs> I was like, were you looking at the screen when you put this base together? So it was all over the place? Yeah. Is it like lopsided, like, the, uh, like, they're, uh, like they were dumb or something? Yeah, more like impaired, like visually impaired. Uh. Whether it's... Like... Walking stick impaired? Like that bad? Um, maybe. Oh, wow. Maybe. Okay. 
Yeah, so like I said, not really work. Hey, so here's the game plan. We'll get that little bunker and we'll start cooking stuff in there. It's cheap and small, right? But I want us to do, um, I think I'm going to call it the meat silo. <laughs> We got. We were cooking it on the front half of the street. <laughs> yeah, dude, it's it's what hot. Tell me. It's a. It's, I saw it. I it's was a on shaft. the server earlier. Oh, you did. You saw it. Yeah, I saw it. I know what it is. Yeah, I think but it's. That's a good name. The meat. You didn't take mine, so I'm happy about that. Wait, I mean, how would I know what it is? Hey, you don't. So I'm glad the meat silos the thing. <laughs> it's better than. I mean, I have the B plug. Yeah, the meat silo, it, because yeah. it's a silo full of dudes, so like, it's definitely, yeah, yeah, it's like human meat. What's up, buddy? What's up, Dow? Oh, oh! Wait, I missed you. Uh. Who doesn't? Ah, uh, okay, now I don't. What's up, Rayla? Hey, can you have a torch semi-ready? Yeah, no problem here. Let me just whip this out. Yeah. Dude, it is so dark. What'd you think about that? That ghillie suit we got, dog. Hi. That's pretty dope, huh? Yeah. I'm doing good, Raylan. How are you? No, I like that, dude. That, you know, it's no double sheet metal door, but I thought that's pretty hot for, like, grubs. Grabs, 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 grabs. Hey, do you have a sleeping bag? Yeah, I felt like grabs. Oh. You place you need the torch out now? Uh, not yet. Here, place your sleeping bag around here. Then we put one in the base. Okay, hold on, let me, uh... Jiris, this is the meat silo. I know, I mean, it is, dude. It's gonna be a silo in the water full of dudes. I got it. Nah, I... I wanted the hooker bag. There we go. Thank you. Hold on. It's crafting. It's sh crafting. That way you still can pop your bag inside the... Yeah, yeah. I only have enough metal for two. Oh, you know what? I'm just going to chop this tree down and make a furnace because I can. Yo, what's up, Signess? Are you down with the sickness? Oh, ah. What the hell's the tree? <laughs> Why did sparks just come off that tree, bro? Because I... Dude, I... Thor. Dog. That's the stupidest thing you've ever said. Is it the dumbest? I mean, I've said some dumb that's, that's shit. Pretty, that's, that's pretty close. Really? Alright, where are we going, dog? The dumbest? It's pretty close. I am Thor. Yeah, you like <laughs> I'm Thor. You like that? Hey, hey guys, when I play Rush, I'm kind of like a, like Thor. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. What have you been doing all weekend so far? Whacking it? Yeah, I mean, you know those feed picks you sent? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tracking it. Oh, you finished. Sweet. Yeah, it took me a while. I'm not used to all that fungus. Ooh. Alright, wait right Close there. Me in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right, type that one in. You weirdo. No problem. Why am I weird? I don't know. What are you breaking down here? Nothing. Oh my god. Uh, Starter is 9,000. You like it? I'll use the pick. No, 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 no. I get, I get 10. I get 10 for every swipe. No, 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 Sam. No, no, I know the sword's efficient, but I can do it. No, 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 I don't want you wasting durability <laughs> on that. You crazy? What's wrong with you? you not. <laughs> I'm using the spear. <laughs> do not. Do not, not do, do it. that again. Do not do it. What's up, James Brown? Hey, man, what, what are we doing in here? All right. Um, I don't like this, you little bitch. That's some loot for you to throw on there. Whoop! I make a bag too for in here. Ooh, woo! Oh yeah, I got tons of pumpkins for you too, dude. And seeds and everything. All right, dog. Level two. What's up? I got you some of them worms too. Big perm. Nah, 
I know you like to put them up your ass. <laughs> I don't have to answer that. Uh, Let's dude. start cooking, you dirty little bitch. Bruh. Bruh. Where'd you get that level 2? It's beat up. Yeah, I bought it. Bruh. Oh, somebody, somebody raided the base already? We will not let what happened last wipe happen again. I'll stick. I don't have access to the CC room. I'm working on it. I don't have enough metal for such activities. Uh, seriously, you don't invite people over and then not have, let them have access to the CC room. Dude, do you want leather straps or not? I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, I am so toxic tonight. Dude, did you get rid of the venom? Dude, why can't I place this shit? What are you trying to place? Fucking low wall. Oh, cause I don't... Hold on. Is <laughs> you unauthorized on your DC? <laughs> oh, dude. Sometimes you can boy you. Oh. Hey, did you see that new tribal Tommy skin dog? Rim shot man. Let the drop dives. If you want to get fucked up, come right ahead. Did you want none of this? I promise you. It'll be headshot, pick to death, take over the base, and ray. You can leave the top. You piece of shit. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Why did I make a key? Don't make a key. Yeah, I'm stupid. Yeah, uh, when I make a base that has peak downs and stuff, like the one you have, I'm gonna name it the Bell Tip. Oh. Uh, the the Queen's the Queen's Math. Or the Mushroom Push, you know. Ah, push it. I wanna see how much we can get away with on YouTube with base names. I like your pumpkin bag. Sean says, how many hours do you have? Let's see, how long is the stream? Three hours and 47 minutes. Yep. Uh, we're new, actually. This is our first wipe. Mm -hmm. I'm actually bad. Yep. Yep. He is bad. 110%. Uh, 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 oh, what? Oil rigs right up here? Oh. Yeah, That's boy. Juicy. All right, you got the... That's hotter than a twat. I didn't even like twats. <laughs> I fucking roasted you, dude. Roasted! Oh, it's oh, 50, not yeah. 20 by fucking shit, bitch. Do you know the axe? Yes. Perfect. Do you I'm like gonna go get stoned. Do you like the axe? Real quick. After I get stung. Oh, yeah. Oh, blow me. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Do you like how absolutely poor the base looks? Yeah, yeah. I love your run the rundown, you know what I mean? It looks like a bag of ass, and then you walk in and you're like, I'm rich. Yeah, we kind of are rich, actually. <sighs> oh, daddy. Prime real estate over here. Ooh, dome's close. Yes. We will go there. I'm so hard up space. What in that actual fuck is huh. that? That's what I'm saying, dude. That's what I'm saying. What in the... I don't know. 
I might die looking at this too long. Yep. It'll actually, it's like Medusa. Jeez, dude. What the? I don't know. Wow, that's terrible. Whoever made this base needs to turn off their console. Maybe they did. I, you know, it, it's either somebody who's... Wow, I can jump to that? Yeah, I do. We should just wreck the base. Are they all stone? No, I they got... I don't know what's going on. They got large furnaces too, dog. Hey, let's do... Okay. Hold up. Let's steal some okay. shit. Yeah, I'll do that and try to find a hole in their base. I'm going to jump inside their base. You want to come over here real quick? Uh, yeah. We can totally take everything out of their furnace. Is it cooking? Uh, no, but we'll take whatever's in there. If they built the base that bad, they couldn't have left anything in there. Or they could have left stuff. They're going to leave stuff in there. You got They're so stupid. Are you good, Doc? Stroke for a second. Yeah. I like it when right. you stroke. It's that age, you know. No, I don't. You know what I'm talking about. I don't. Hey, I got Star's hammer. <laughs> Do you have Star's hammer too? This is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Alright, so it's, we, it's pretty neat. We have locks Come all the way here. in. I gotta finish the lock, dildo. Do you like the way I talk to you? Like a little yeah, it's a street, street tramp. Just makes me want to like, you know? Yep. That I forgot to make. Oh man, dude, I forgot to make that shit deal. Yeah. Hotter than a twat twat. Hotter than a big old meat stick. Alright, it's cooking. You have uh, code access on oh, the Oh, they're way. coming out. They're coming out. Dude, whoever built that base. Oh my goodness. It's bad. How many are there? Just one. One dude. I'm gonna come over to the base real quick and drop off the pick and stuff on the top. And I'm gonna jump in there. These guys. Jeez. They don't know what's going on. The, yeah, that's there's something wrong with these kids. <laughs> smooth, that's some smooth brain shit. It is. It's a hole. I'm gonna go build a base. I'm like, dude. Don't ever build this base again. I'm gonna drop this off to you, okay? I might need the wood. Alright! Round one of Razor being a troll. Uh. I heard beep 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 when I put a threw up some uh, twig. Oh uh, yeah, they're like, "What's going on?" <laughs> Who's raiding? I thought raided. we were in the alliance. <laughs> yeah, you get raided. <laughs> I thought we were in the alliance, Steve. I thought we... you talked to the Mad Clan. I thought you talked to uh, what was it? The oh, French Connection. Gosh. Yeah, <laughs> no French Touch. Remember? Ah, uh, it was French. Oh yeah, whatever. You know, in Hydra, whatever their names were. Oh, yeah. look at that guy, he's geared on top. Look at this idiot. How do they even have that gear? He's looking around. He's looking around. He's like, who goes there? Who is it? Look at him. He's... I need to jump over this. I'm gonna probably die in the fence. I see him. He still hasn't seen me yet. Wow, the impaired is a. Uh... Told ya. Wow. Okay. Look at him. He's like, I'm a cat. I got all this gear. Wait till I go to dome and get an SMG body and come up there and ram a Tommy up your ass. 
Oh, I would have. Man, this is too easy. This guy's standing in on his roof in the open. This guy's gonna get shot. Oh, dude, if I had a Tommy right now, this guy would be dead. I'd go in there, ladder up, take his kit, and be like, bum, 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 bum. Hey, thanks for the shit. Your Look pick is in the. Pixelated flower. It looks like a. Your pick's in the uh, bunker seal makes... box. Huh. I gotta go get some shit. Look to this guy. What's he doing? Why is he taking a kneel? Well, if we get a bunch of sulfur, I think I know where we're going. Yeah. We may not even need sulfur, if you know what I'm saying. We might be able to kite him I out. Think. You could probably go deep on these guys. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We could kite him out and just take his kit and then go deep on him. Don't let me go deep again. He's still on top. Base, 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 do they have code locks or wood locks? <sighs> Do you know what they have on the door? Can I jump it? Pipe it, pipe it, pipe it. <gasps> I'm inside your compound, Steven. They're turning on turrets and stuff. Uh, I'm hearing phantom noises. I'm picking up your pumpkins. Now I'm eating your pumpkins. What do you think about that? This is beyond easy. We gotta just gotta put some honeycomb on the base a little bit before we really aggro these fools. Just in case. They have a farm box outside. They do? So they put all their smelted stuff. Oh wow. Next to the furnaces. Oh yeah. Whoa, 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 what the hell is cutting me? That ain't right. That ain't right, though. They only have one way in and out, too. Oh, my. We're going to box these fools in. All we need to do is just get... Because I've got Timmy. I've got DB. we got Roller Boys. If we start cooking up our metal, dude, we're going to be all set. Oh, so yeah. We should just get make wooden armor and, and go do dome and just get some shit. Because that's yeah. why I bought the level, too. We can make whatever we want. Oh, yeah. How much did you buy for? How much sulfur? Uh, a thousand. A steel. That's what I'm saying, dude. It helps them out. It's, it's easier not to get yeah. a thousand sulfur compared to a thousand scrap. Yeah. Uh. Oops. This, man, this guy's really worried. And all I have is a rock. He's just opening doors, going up and down. I've been planting everything under the water so they can't really get a beat on how active we are and they can't steal our shit. Try to get a lot of wood now in case we get pinned in so at least we can still cook. Yeah. Smart man. Okay. Can I build in here or no? Or nah? No? Let's find where your weakness is, boy, and then I'll deal with you. If we get enough wood, I can make honeycomb on the outside that's wood. That would be kind of hot. Well, I do know this inside their compound. Um, they definitely have wood walls. <laughs> so, wow, this might be an issue for them. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? For them, mostly, yeah. I mean, I'm just grubbed right now, so I'm not worried about this fool, but... He is really worried. I should throw my rock at him. Just to let him know what's up, you know? Tell him know you love him. Is there an opening anywhere? Oh, dude, look at this low point. You can actually double jump over... If I get Jade in here, I could jump over that. Jeez. Let's go get, uh, I think I got rope. Let's go get wooden armor. Let's go do dome. Let's, let's craft some stuff. Let's get a little bit of low grade so we get another furnace going, right? Let's get dirty, man. Alright, I'm gonna put I'm wood in. for a foundation. I got you. Area. Baby, I know what you do. I know you. Baby. I'm gonna throw my rock at his crib. I Jade stands here, I jump off his head over the fence, take their loot in their smelting box. Transfer it through this crack right here. Then I respawn. Jade comes back in and throws it somewhere. Maybe back here. Game over. This is why you know you gotta learn how to build and rest. Cause if you don't, you'll get banged hard. Oh yeah. So our jump ups in the back Dude. so people we can hear him coming with the water splashing. You already know. Oh yeah. I'm just running around this compound. I'm just trying to figure out where I can play stuff. Is there a hole over here? Oh my goodness. There's a hole right here too. Oh my! We could literally take all their loot. Do I make a skinny from those boxes? Oh, is these turrets right here, dog? They're not shooting me. What turrets is that? Like three, and they're not shooting me. They have no ammo. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. They do have ammo. <laughs> they might have a little. Maybe a little. <laughs> they have turrets only on one side. They don't have turrets on their furnace side yet, so. Well, don't alarm them. We want we want that to be. Push uh, leg. No, I died on the turret side. Oh yeah. Three, four, five, six. I should have dunk your face under the water and plant that shit. Touch your mouth. I brought it from the river. You can lick my balls. I'm gonna get some uh, stuff. Hold up. Yeah, so I said I was at Apple. Oh, we need stone, huh? Yeah, we do. We need stone? Yeah. Your okay. your pick is. I want to build a, a bunker as well, so I want to make like a little grub village. All right. Can we, can we put in the water first? What are you doing? I'm stuck in here. I don't know why you went that way. I don't know why I went in here either. I was just coming for a kiss. Dude, that guy was scared. He got on top of the roof with like a, a bolty and then he had a Tommy. Dude, we're gonna... If I would have had a gun, he would have been laid out. Laid out. Hey, do we have any ropey rope? Let's go make you some wooden armor and you go run down. Your thoughts? Okay. Uh... You... I'll come with you. You want me to come with you, bitch? 
Where are you going? We're going to Dome. I don't have an axe for wood. Huh? We gotta get stone. Yeah, we do. Yeah, let me get stone, hold on. Let me get a couple notes. Let me go to Dome. I need you to- And those guys base? Weak. I need you to give me Dome. You, you know, build like that on a slope like that, dude. You need a base and a compound. I, I, I don't know. Not like that. That was like first day of wipe, and they were like, "Oh, I'm so scared right now." How's it go? Did you plant yeah. those seeds, or did you throw them on the ground? Threw them on the ground, didn't no, you? No, I have. There's some in the box. Oh, oh, he puts them back in the box. What a god. Oh, well, at least you put them in the box. Better than throw it away. And I brought 40 of them from uh, the river. I might have planted all those. Okay, good. I'm about to plant more. Look when we need food, I'm just going to do a river run. I'm going to go up and down. Up and down. Until I lick your chocha. Damn, dude. Where's all the... What? I ain't seen a seen a stone dog. You don't see any? Is that what you're saying? Ah, what is this broke place? That's why we gotta get in the water and get a boat going so we can go to the desert and just freaking clean up. We just go take the boat, uh, do, yeah. a, do a run, come back rich as hell. And yeah, like, get a jackhammer, a jacket on each other. Yes. Yeah. Found a metal now. Up and down until you lick that cho cha. A cho cha. Sure or false? Some things in this game. Uh, True. Just, just is ridiculously high. Sure. I.e. turrets. Yeah, um, turrets, turrets are pretty loud. Yeah. Barbecue. Barbecue is obscene. Sure. Makes me angry. Yeah, I don't know what those guys' base is, but told you it was bad, dude. They like, have really a furnace box, dude. After we go to dome, get some wolf weapons. They're on the hit list for sure because that shit's dookie. Yeah, it's it's doo doo butter. The uh, straight up. Straight up. Says, when's cargo supposed to hit? It's supposed to be next week, supposedly. Sometime next week. We don't know when. We don't have a date. They did stay on uh, Discord that they are still planning for mid July. And it's still coming. They just gotta. F they just gotta test it a little bit. Yeah, I'm cooming. Are you a coomer? Yeah. Are you? Yeah. So look, look. Luke. I am your father, Luke. Release your anger, right. young Skywalker. Have you guys seen the Obi Wan show yet? No. Oh man, we gotta have a boyfriend night and uh, do that. I mean, you gotta romance me a little bit. Nah, bro, it's pretty dope. You gotta romance me, you know what I mean? I like it. Lot, I, some people were busting that show, but I was just like, I liked it. Anything Star Wars, I'll have to say. Ooh. You know? Yeah, I know. I thought Boba Fett's kind of weak. It was weak, but I like the fact that they're making shows on, based off of characters that you can focus on, you know? Yeah, and I hope they pick you it learn up. A, yeah, I hope yeah, they, you, you learn a little bit more about their story. Which well, I like, I feel like the... I'm not going to give anything away, but it start, I feel like it starts off stupid slow. What, Boba Fett? Boba Fett. You just like, yeah, oh it my goodness. It did. Yeah, it it was slow. They, I think they picked it up, but I didn't. To be honest, halfway through whatever this is, I'm kind of like, hey, I'm gonna go take a yeah. shit and make a sandwich. Yeah, yeah. You have to be like committed, you know, because the front half you're like, ooh. You yeah, know. it just. I mean, ooh. it's cool. I like it, but a also, little rough. But I also am like, hey, yeah, uh, we get it. Boba Fett Flashback. is like a badass, you know? Doesn't he have a dad bod, though? That guy's a... Huh? Huh? Dad bod? Yeah, even if he does, who cares? 
most sides like you know. I could whoop ass like that and have it that bad, then. Dude, you know. It says that's awesome that they're bringing this. Underwater labs would be good. Yes, it would. We do know it's cargo though. Happy Canuckle. Oh, look at this little. This little grub here is trying to jump into that base. Man, little snakes on this server, man. It says Star Trek, yeah, that's what's up. <gasps> Top hat comes in the chase. It's what server are you on? I'm not gonna fucking tell you. Actually, it's uh, server 49. Yeah. Anybody get that uh, reference? The server's <laughs> called Your Mom's Busted and her pussy's got to fuck. Your mom's hot, but does he? I'm going across the desert to farm it. I'm farming over in this area right now. I'm trying to get that stone. I'm just messing, army. We just don't give out our servers. I'm just giving you crap because everybody comes in and says that. It's just like when everybody comes in and they're like, Hey, Razor, did you know your FOV exists? I'm like, yeah. I'm playing Call of Duty, bro. Shaka bruh. Trying to live my rust life, you know? He says, Dad, dude, wanted to bring my 15 man and farm for you. No, I, bro, you, th you think I want handouts? I'm trying to get smacked around a little bit, you know? Yeah, he's not lying. Uh, yeah. No, thanks for, off for offering, dude. I appreciate it. We just don't give out server information. I think oh, I, I got a combat knife. Combat kniff. Yeah, somebody messing with me, I'll cut him. Oh, great. Now my dog wants out. Awesome. Hold on. This base is decayed. Also, I'm questioning the upgrade choices here, but. I'm gonna I... go sit in the outpost for a second. Oh, yeah. About to get a free box. Chad, I just gotta sit in the outpost for a second. Oh yeah. Oh, I gotta let my let my horse out. You have a horse in your house? Yeah, I gotta let my horse cock out. Yeah, it's weird. Is it though? Nah. Beat it up. Alright, chat. You let me know if somebody, you know. Sniffs his box. I love that those guys are all scared. Come on, get up there, bitch. Dude, these freaking boars need to eat a big fat one. Did it. How many boars can possibly be on the edge here? Jeez. What's up, Mr. Cobb? This is good evening, gentlemen. Good evening. One, two, three, four, hot box.
Jay, is that your pug? I don't know. A decent haul considering I'm just kind of wandering around in this shithole. <laughs> Hello. Yo, dog, I'm back. I'm yo, like yeah, 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 dude, you got a glizzy? What's up? What's up? What's up? Nothing. Who's house? Who's Steve? Ooh, dude, somebody's ripping a freaking sniper shot by oil rig. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Must be in a boat. It's probably a homeboy. Well, you know what we should do? Let's uh, get let's get settled in just a yeah. little bit, and then let's wait for these idiots to go do oil rig, and then you know we can sleep them on their way out. You know we can. He's, oh, yeah. he's going to be feeling oh, so yeah. good about himself, and we're going to be like, I can seal Team 6, dude, coming out of the water just... You got that combat knife with the silent kill. Yeah, that. Yeah, that. And come out. It'll be like. Is that your butthole? What are you, what are you simulating there? Oh, the old scuba tank. Oh, that was your butthole. Dude, the names of the servers are weird. Like, what name did they use for yours? <laughs> yeah, it's called um, Eat a Dick. Can you search it? Yeah. Oh, what's up, center? What's up, dude? Good to see you. What's up, dude? What's up, what's up Torka? Torka. Torka says, finally remember to follow Razor, says. Got both your streams up. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, what's that shit? That's what's up. I got a hazzy suit? I'm Ooh. going in. Oh, I got military crate? Ooh, 22 high qual? Ooh. Where are you? Oh, yeah? I'm in a supermarket. <laughs> Mad loot, dude. Mad loot, dog. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm rich. I can't stop looting these boxes. Matthew, that's close. But yeah, tell him, Luke. Tell him. Say, Matthew, stop. I got you a hat, dog. That's what I came over here for. For reals, Dow. Ooh. Ooh. Did you Bust in John, John Razor Rambo. Yeah. You've been liking those videos, huh? It's live time. Been liking them. I gotta get back to the crib, dude. I'm loaded. You mean to tell me? Yeah, so am I. I gotta, uh, I'm pushing it to the limit here. I better get back. Yeah, I know. I I'm got farm, kind of dude. Yeah, yeah. I got some. Look I got at some all these components. circuit. Oh, dude, th that looks. Look at chat. You remember the guys we raided last wipe? That looks like their freaking base. Oh, maybe. Oh man. You know how easy that is. Yeah. No kidding. It's real easy. I got another pick for free, dog. I'm skeezing my way back home. Skeezing my way down. Skeezing my way downtown. I'm sticking your butt, taking a sniff. He says, imagine trying to get the server name so you could stream snipe. Yeah, I know, right? I know. Fucking scrub. 
<clears throat> so, you know, like, if you look at Top Army, for instance, right? Like, I don't know him, know him, right? But, apparently he's got a 15 man, right? How do I know if I would ever give him the server number if he'd come here with his 15 man and raid me? Or help me? You know? I think it would start. You ready? I think it would start with, "Will help you," but if it's not what they expected, they will turn on you. Or if somebody yeah. accidentally kills somebody because we're not in the same setup, they'll just yeah. start killing us. And I was like, "Well, that was fun." Like, there's a reason why we don't do it. He said, "Torcas says I've been meaning to follow you for a minute. Thanks, dude. Appreciate yeah, it." Torcas, good dude. He's been over here for a while, and he's a member. Oh. He's a member. Yeah. Sure. You better crack open that piggy bank. Come over here. No, I'm just kidding. Um, hey, do you want? Center says a man. Sorry. Uh, there's at that one shop. It's like 300 bucks. Do you want a custom? 300 selfie. You just want to go? I already know custom. Yeah, but like, it's already all the mats and shit. It's like 300 sulfur, dude. It's a sulfur node. You sure you don't want to just get one? We can. Yeah. I mean, the guys are so far away from us. I don't think there'll be a problem. Yeah. I'm just bringing stuff home right now. Did yeah. you learn combat knife or no? I did not. Okay, I'm bringing one home. Making my way downtown. Wait a it domes? Are okay. you walking on the beach? Watch. Oh, okay, that's you. Yeah. yeah I, was like, I was like, there's a dude going counterclockwise know, right? on the shoreline. I was ready to fucking give you cords. <laughs> uh, yeah, dog. What did Sandra say? Says, imagine, do it, everyone imagine. Oh, Torka. <laughs> he cracked up, opened that damn piggy bank, and he, he's a member on the side, too, now. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> thanks, Torka. I appreciate it, dude. Yeah, you get a thanks, specialty dude. badge next to your name in the live stream chat now, and access to the custom emotes on them. When we have custom servers, you're just a shoe in now. That's right. Yeah. Watch this drop once you drop it. Right, okay, I'll watch for you. Do you ever swim oh, on the yeah, surface of the water and just keep your head just below so nobody sees you? Hey, do you got a big box made or no? I do. Okay, thank you. I'm going to throw this in there. Oh, ooh, I just put my pants. Yep, twice. Come on, drop. Drop. i got to save some... Or i got to get some stone for the old bunkies too. Remind me of that. Yeah, but we got to throw the water thing up right quick. Or at least the first floor, so like we are out and away. Uh. No, I don't see the drop. Is that the drop? Oh, I do see the drop. It's kind of by the outpost. You want to go over there anyway to get you to your go custom? For it. Yeah, let's go get. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring this sword. I'm gonna get butt naked. I'm gonna bring 300 sulfur so we can get you a Tim. Or a uh, custom. Okay. Where's the... It's by the outpost, you'll route. see it. Just keep going the outpost, which is like 290 west-ish. Yeah, 290, yeah. Let's see, Sinner said he had me too, Torko. All my team lost interest and stopped playing. Oh, really? Itches. Why? I noticed a lot of people... <clears throat> so here... Oh, dude, there's a guy right there going towards oil by himself. Boat going from 160 to one. It's gotta down. be that guy. It's gotta be, right? Um, you'll notice the more you guys play Rust in general, especially for my console people, people on PC already know this, but when you play Rust, when there's not an update for a while, oh, that's way by outpost. Hopefully I can get there. Um, when you play Rust for a while, a lot of people come back and then they quit and come back because they wait for the update. I call them the spoil Rust players, right? Because they're the, they're the people that don't stick with it the whole time. They just come back for the updates. You know what I'm saying? But once we get like cargo and minis and cars and stuff, people will be like, Oh, mm, mm. cream. Oh man, why do we have cars? Why are cars armored? But there's always going to be a complaint, right? That's how it goes with Rust. Like on PC and console, everybody's going to bitch about something, and then it's like, okay, dude, just tough it out for a little while, and it'll change eventually, you know? Oh, yeah. 
You know what I like. Well, I just heard an AK. Yep, it's over by us. That's kind of why I want to get a little bit beefier in case they got some. If they keep running oil rig, they got a couple spare C4s. Oh, they'll have some stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm a little based concerned off of about. Their, based off of their base building, I don't think I'm worried. I'm not worried about them. I'm just worried about them having free shit. Yep. Because they keep running oil. Yep. Where's that drop? There it is. Oh, yeah. That kind of outpost. That's in the distance. I don't think I could get to that even if I tried. I mean, I'm gonna try, but. What's a chair? Oh, there's some geared guys right here. In the game, I'm not. My knife. Yes. I just took you guys a DB. I I sorted them to death. <laughs> And that's why I want you to go over there. <laughs> I knew that was coming, dude. I could feel it. Son. You're like, I nipped him? I'm Barely like, hurt yeah. me. Corkador is now on the main TC. He was like looking at me and I'm like, what are you doing? So you want to kiss? I kind of biffed throwing my sword at him. This drop's going to be gone before I even get to it. But I got a gun. Threw my sword at him, but I accidentally hit down on the joystick too quick, and it snapped and threw it at the ground. I was like, "Uh oh!" So I picked it up again and then got him to death. Radical, radical. See, Torka says I've never had a solid team. Made it like a wipe and a half with one, always off of Facebook. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, a lot of people, man, uh, they quit too fast because they're like, oh, there's not enough content. But then as soon as you give them content, they're like, we want more. My no? pussy stinks. Yeah. So it's like, uh, I don't know. Beggars can't be choosers, man. Then once you give them something, they're all like, oh. Ooh, woo. It will slap it in. Oh yeah, oh, with all these compounds. Yeah, he had that potato in for sure. I didn't. I don't uh, know. With I the was sword. Yeah, I was having it earlier. Yeah. People don't understand how bad that sword hurts, man. Hurts my feelings. Butt cheeks. Butt cheeks. Ass. Butt, 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 ass, 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 ass. There it is. It is. And I'm probably the wrong dude to give the double barrel to. Why? I doubt this drop will be over here. I mean, we can go and push and see, but... Ain't no way I think that's there, boy. The dude was in Whiff City. You guys gonna do oil soon? Sorry, I joined him late. So, um, we gotta get the base up and stuff. Twerk, twerk. What 
Ooh, we got goggles too, baby. Dude, we have um. We have a garage door. I got two pairs of goggles. I brought back. Mm. Yeah. I'm definitely trying to flirt. Right, Just wait. Is this test branch? We don't say anything about the server. I keep forgetting to put rules in my chat. Gotta take a page out of the old pros book. That way I can be like, did you see the rules? Did you see them? Medicaid kisses. <laughs> Ray's is really cracking me up right now. Yeah, dude, he's a big flirt. I know, I'm, getting, I'm getting crazy tonight. That dude got laid out, he got pushed. He's like, who's this guy in the sword? I was like, here you Get you done, kid. Oh, These yeah. swords are OP, bro. Yes, they are. I mean, not as OP as your face. Ooh, I just got bug shot. Or, uh... Slug? Slug, yeah. Jeez. You good? Yeah. I got incendiary. This is fair enough. I'll continue watching. Hoping my base doesn't get raided while I'm off. Funny enough, never had an online raid yet. Always been offline. H Man says, Is there a skin for double door sheet metal? I freaking wish. You're gonna make me lose my mind, whoever fucking said that. Because I've been saying it in every damn video, hoping double eleven would at least watch thirty seconds of it to give us that door. <laughs> Ooh, I got a bow and arrow. Boner? Yep. A floner. Floners are pretty cool. Did you get on top of dome yet? Nope. You I wanna am give me stuff? Collecting goods. I'm gaming, bro. I said you wanna give me dome? No. It's rude. Negative. How's it rude? It says Razor reminds me of Weird Al in UHF. He does, doesn't he? What's up? Weird Al. J Duke oh says I love God. your voice. Oh, someone's flirting over here. Flirting with you? Don't worry about it. I'm an independent woman. Get off me. And I could always ban him. Don't ban him. No you? This guy. If he's flirting with you, bro. Yeah, deal with it. You gotta be happy for me. I've never, don't ever say that stupid statement ever again to me. <laughs> Gotta be happy for me. Yeah, Shut the you like, fuck you up. Like, I'm not. <laughs> yeah. It's the opposite. I clearly, I'm not. Be like, oh, it's, so it's about me. Then. And he's over here being a flues. <laughs> We're gonna catch these fools slipping at the oil rig. Oh, ah, oh. I'm going around the airfield and grabbing some dicks. Tough. Did you get the drop, pussy? No. Oh. It was. I went all the way out there and nothing. Yeah, did you kill know. a man though? Take his DB. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. I got his weapon. He kept the gun warm. But there is a naked with a torch out running across the beach. This poor guy. He's gonna get slept. Yeah, online raids are online raids are the shit. That's just. A lot of people don't do them. A lot of people piss out. They're like, oh, I don't want to lose my gear to the people on that. It's like, well, just nut up and go over there. Oh. Yeah? Nut up. Everybody wants to get all scared. Oh. Like, I mean, obviously, like, there's a lot of offline raids because... Everybody's not going to be on at the same time. Like, I'm not going to go plan to raid somebody. Ooh, I see somebody with a flashlight on. Oh, that is mistake. not. That is not a scientist. I wonder if turning on the light and then walking like a robot will make you people think that you're a scientist. <laughs> yeah, just do like clean lines and do like 180s. 
There's a geared guy running somewhere over here by the coast. It's so wet. He's right here. Why not he lost? Coming out he's coming on our side. Where's the ploy? Is there a box in here? Is this a car? He's coming on our side, coastline dude. I'm not I'm over by OP. Dog. Yeah, I think I've been like six bots, maybe seven now. It's kinda ridiculous. Got him. I oh, heard. Shit, he's I heard that. Take it back to the crib. What's his gun? Oh. Got it. Got it, Tommy. Hell yeah. Reloading. Is that by our beach? Was that by a gas station? Or supermarket? By our beach. Beach directly across from, uh, well, not really. Beach across dome. Okay, so by the fishing village? Yeah. Kind of, but not really. Is it by a parallel to the river? Or is it it's, a land bridge? Um, like you know how we have the land bridge that goes uh, to Maryland? our little island. Yeah. Right. A across the water, on the other side. Yeah. Like across from Dome. Yeah, fishing village. Oh, is it like the inlet? So, so it's on the outskirts of outpost. Oh, that that was close then. With the high rocks. Yeah. I clapped him. Slept him real good, huh? Oh yeah, he's a dead man. He is no longer with us. I juked him pretty bad too, because I hit him twice with the DB and then uh, I jumped on the power line post to hide behind it. And then he tried healing up and he failed. Oh yeah, yeah I did him dirty pretty bad. You're hot. Dog. I juked him pretty bad. He was bad at the game. I didn't have to go to Dome, I got a DB and a Tommy while I was out. Perfect. Uh, I just recycled some shit, I'm heading uh, back to the base. Cover got of some night. metal, some sulfur, and uh, some stone for you, and some comps. Camps. Can I cop that ass though? Man, that guy was bad. How did I go from sword? <laughs> I don't know. To this. You did leave with a justice sword. I did. Pretty cute though. Oh, thank god you made other boxes. Yeah, you kind of filled up the other one, you freaking scrub. Oh man, I got his whole road tank kit. I didn't even realize that. Oh. That's funny. Dude, that guy's bad then. Jeez. Yeah, I killed him with the AB and a Hazzy. He didn't even hit me once. And he had a, um, over a stack 
of pistol rounds on him too. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's hot. Yeah. Talking Jeez. About bad, huh? Sounds like our neighbors are at home, huh? Yeah. Uh, I mean, judging by that base build, I'm gonna say that was that's him. <laughs> yeah. He says, from knife to to DB to Tommy, well played. <laughs> This game's hot. Uh, I don't know what he was thinking. Of it. I don't know. I might got his bullets and his gun, so. He says, can you do the intro, please? I can't do it while people are listening. Do you like that coconut skin? That's right. Oh, sorry. What did you say? Do you like that coconut like skin coconut for the ride? Where he's like, oh! Yeah. I can't even put a repair bench down. Honestly. Yeah, I'm, kind of, I'm coming back to make some expansion. Yeah, I can. So. Can you, um, I gotta change what I'm wearing. Do you see how I slid the bag up? Closer to the thing? Just make sure it's yeah. not in the socket. If you can slide yours up. Oh. We got some fighting at 300, just outside outpost. Oh, really? On the probably high side? Guy. Probably. They're probably pissed. Dude, I just ruined that poor child's life. Good. Let's check out that tribal skin, man. <sighs> the horses look so goofy. Don't they? They're like, <gasps> they bit. They were like that on on PC for the longest time. Let's get that golden gun, boy. Mm. So is anything new with the PTB aim training? Anything new yet? Uh, no. We're still waiting on gotta go sheep. Base database database. Oh, that's a dope skin, these tribal ones. Does it glow a little bit on the trim? It it glows everywhere. The whole thing glows. Oh, that's hot. Let's go, let's yeah. go smoke people, dude. Well, now we can go do oil rig. Pretty much. We just need a little bit of low grade, homie. Keep killing that guy. I bet he'll have some eventually. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah, what a cock. I literally just ran out of ammo for the DB, too. I could hear it at the outpost. Well, I could hear it through your mic, but I also could hear it at the outpost. And I was like, ooh, you sound close. Oh, we were pretty close. Hey, bitch. Oh, yeah, it does. That looks, that looks dope. What do you want? Where do you want this bag? Uh, see how mine's like slid up, close to the socket. Yeah. You want that? Yeah. So I can I can jam a couple more uh, deals back here. Oh, look at that jade skin, boy. That might be on you the socket. Oh no, you're good. You're good. No, that's not on the socket. I know how to do that. Look at this one, dude. Look at this skin. It looks hot. You want me to hold it's it? Dope. You want to you want to take a screenshot? Yeah, dude. Alright, don't move. Don't move. Here, pick it up again. Oh, I thought you were gonna. Okay. No, both, I both, both, both. Yeah, you look, you look fresh. Fresh and hot. No move. You look fly, bitch. I like that, dude. That's dope. Are you good? Yes. Put on the hazzy. Where is it at? It's in the top left box. Put on that hazzy. Turn this HUD off. I get that sexy. Oh, that's hot! Got both streams up on my laptop. I saw a comment back and forth. Hell yeah. Saltino. <laughs> that's funny. Well, let me... Hello there. Oh, that's too damn bright. Don't do that again. 
Oh man, look at me, look at me. Oh, that is high right there. All right, perfect. Thank you. Appreciate you, dog. For real, dog. Let me wear my dirty tank top. Smells like Chuck E. Cheese and shit. Dude, this new skin slaps, dude. Your butt slaps? Slaps good. I like it. I wonder if that guy's pissed I took all his loot. Oh, for sure. Oh, you know he's pissed. You want to go to Dome with me real quick so we can get some more comps? Oh, uh, yeah, just one sec. I thought I had a freaking fridge. <coughs> you might have, you know. Uh oh. Oh. That's a lot of feet. Hold on, hold on. We got to seal it. No. No, you're good. Don't worry about it. That was a lot of feet. That's a whole group, dude. Huh. If I hear explosions, I'm sealing. Yep. I bet you that's the crew that got fucking robbed. Let me go ahead and cap him. Um. I don't know what the play is for this. I can kill him. Yeah, but then they're gonna be up our ass again. Maybe we'll wait to see what they do. I can hear him outside. Oh yeah. Uh, they, yeah, they're coming to raid. For sure they are. Got a DB in here. Did you spawn outside? No, I did not. You got a bag out there? Uh, I do. Will you spawn out there? Yes, give me a sec. I just want to see if somebody's at our back door. I got you. Yeah, I do, Austin. Hostiles. There is two gear guys outside. One's on the top. One is uh, around the back. Yeah, don't go out. You're just going to get clapped. I just want to see what they're going to do. I think they're watching when their boy comes out. Oh, guy spotted me. If you want to come on and shoot the guy. No, don't shoot the guy on the roof. Never mind. He's got a pretty good angle on you. Yeah. Alright, keep watching. No, I, I actually run away like I spawned on the beach. He killed you? Yeah, he killed me. I'm pretty sure that's the same guy. Did I clap? Yeah, it, there's two of them. He shot me, so I'm about to get a name. Sybil? With an S? Do you know what that guy's name was? No. No. Sybil Xbox. Thanks, Butch. I don't know. I think they're waiting. Oh, for sure. I'm going to get up on the hill and take a look and see where these guys go.
I don't think they have any boom. And if they come over, I'll quick spawn over. And then I'll seal the, the bunker and then we'll close the thing and be like, all right, you guys really want to come in for this? Be my guest. You got a ladder? They do? I think oh yeah, they're writing. Okay, I'm coming oh, they're in. they're using a plant there. Okay, I'm going to seal the bunker. Perfect. Perfect. Do you want me to... I would just keep your stuff in here because there's two of them right now. I can clap them. If you want, well, but let me seal first. Wait, wait, wait. I'll do it yet. Oh wait, I have to like seal it this way. Oh, that's right. Hurry up, seal that. Here, actually, here, 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 you seal it. I need to be on the inside. Remember, soft side towards me. Um, the, the door on the top here. It's fine. They're about to get shit stuffed. I knew where they were. I'd jump up there, but they don't. Yeah, they're all over. There's at least two. I think there's three. I could honestly open this door and gun down one. Yeah, but then what? The other guy's gonna come after you? True. <laughs> Are you still in here? Yeah. Okay. I I'm have gonna, to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, play. Play. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make play. this metal. And Stop this metal. Come play. Bitch. Watch this. Oh my dick. You gonna play? That looks like you're scared, man. Ah. Am I? Razor loves that. Am I scared? Yeah. Seal this up. Hold on. Let me give you some metal fragments. And then I'm going out to play. Yeah, because if you could drop one, I'll pick up a kit and then we'll pin him down and just Yeah, right I need up. you to spawn outside though, so you need to give me metal in there. Hey, okay, here's metal. Do you have wood? When you do it, flick the soft side towards me for the twig. Thanks, dog. So, there you go. Ah, oh, I don't get a metal. Oh, you don't? Did uh, you come out? It's alright, don't worry about it, it's done. Holy fuck, quit upgrading. Go outside. There's people outside your base. You should have been outside. Look at this guy. Hey, listen to him. Uh, I hear him. Two last time. Motherfucker, we literally just were on the server for an hour and a half, bitch. What are you talking about? Yeah. Hey, spawn outside and let me see. Yeah, there's two of them on the roof. I'm gonna look at your stream, hold on. I wanna see what I'm dealing with. Did you murk yourself? Oh, you did. Okay. I just want to see where they're at in relation to where I'm at. Yeah, you've got the... They're going to fucking pop you because there's only one way out. One's in the water. Oh, I see, yeah. Wait, the only way out is left, right? Yeah. 
So inherently they would be over there? Yeah, one's on the ladder, the other one's climbing up. Did they burn the doors off? Later, Mike. Don't spam. Fuck the kid. Yeah. If you can run up and distract somehow. Okay. I'll tell you if they I'll got jump it. out. I'll tell you if they got it. I her. have to know if one's upstairs. No, okay, they're leaving. They're leaving now? Where are they going? Come outside, come outside. If you're going to come out. One's going up the hill, 290-ish. Oh, nope, he's coming back to the base. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. He's down by the shore. What a pussy. You wait for us to run away to come out? Hit him twice. He's alive. He's crashed behind that rock. Three of them. This AKs and everything. Yeah, I just got shot in the face. All right, I'm gonna upgrade that bunker. <laughs> Baby. Make damn sure this thing's sealed. All right, hang on before you get out there. I'm gonna seal it up with uh. How you gonna come out when we run away? Dude, who is this fucking and hill jack? Back in when you shoot at us. I don't know, he's some hillbilly who's stupid. How you are you gonna shoot? Three V one. Yeah, I know. Here, can you seal it now? Hold on. Three V one and this guy's door camping me. I think that the guy's up on that jacked up base. I think so too. I'm gonna go take a look. Now I can upgrade. Yeah, can you throw it down there? Love you. I'm gonna go take a look. I'm gonna put this gear inside there. Guys yeah, talking about PvP. Bro, the only kit we have is the one we still have your boy. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Part of me wants to Fuck go you, out there. Uh huh. Yeah, okay. Nice, nice bait. Make sure you seal it. I'll seal it now. I'm gonna go look. You go look. <laughs> we're gonna go home. Uh huh. Well, they know where one of my bags are. Just come out of PvP. Do you not see the wood outside? <laughs> yeah. It's like, keep coming over here. We'll have kits. I mean, once I got a hold of that one dude. I hit him twice or three times, and then he, he backed off, and then he had AK boy and another guy at the top, you know? See how he's firing in the background to bait me out? Not mm -hmm. going to happen. There's a guy at the door still, guaranteed. I'm gonna go see where they live. I'm pretty sure it's that jack shit base over there. Ah, oh, I didn't see who killed me like- Oh, because I killed myself. Shit. I wanna get more names. We gotta know who we're fighting. Are you here? No, I am not. Oh man, if we just had a little bit more of a foe, we could take these kids out, no problem. I know. Because they're bad. Well, if they're bad and they just don't... They're basically door camping. The door on the left is still there. Oh, so they burned out the wooden lock one? Yeah. So I could technically open this door and I'd be okay. Yeah, you could. You could create like a little airlock with it. Are you by the way? No, I am not. They're burning something. Oh, oh. they're burning the doors. The double doors. Yeah. Well, I'm glad I upgraded what I did. Yeah. We're good. I had it's a all feeling. Metal, yeah, I had a feeling, dude. Like, I knew this was going to be the next step, dude. Hey, keep a... Oh, shit. Got the laser. Keep an eye on him. Oh, shit. I might be able to get out and clap him. Oh, running out of here. Uh. 
There yeah, was I a, mean, there was a laser at the garage too. For people who have AKs and Tommies and stuff, I mean, come out PVP. We're door camping you. Only one way out. Jeez, lose a couple more teeth and talk to me. Fucking scrub. Yeah, they're still here. They're just. I need to take down their ladders. Is what I need to do. As soon as Jade gives me the deets, then we'll be able to do it. Uh, what the fuck are they doing? Is too close to a monument? What? Are they still over here? I don't know. Hang on, I'm just trying to get into position. I might actually be Sounds fighting. Sounds like it. Might be fighting somebody. I think they are. Should I open it? Uh, that sounds like a hell of a barrage. I don't know. I'm not over there. You can try. Fuck it. They're not next to the base. At least the. Uh, at least two guys aren't. Yeah, they're a real tommy door camp. Somebody is like, "Damn, dude, this is locked." Taking their uh, lighters off. Oh, you are nice. Yeah. Took them off. They're yeah. off now. Good. Now it's time for the hunter to become the hunted. I'm gonna go after him. If you got to, you, can always, kid, you, I don't care. you can always swim out to the fishing village if you really need to. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Get my brains blown out? Well, you know, like, you don't necessarily have to. Oh, this guy's looking over here. Uh oh, I might get shot in my back. Oh, Where they're are you at? all Where at you? the fucking gas station, all three of them. Are they really? Yep. They're gonna go chase me through the water, I can feel it. Are they following you? I don't know. I'm hiding under the rock. Okay. I'm going up top. I only have... We gotta make it like another exit out of there so we're not pinned in like that. Yeah. I didn't think we'd get raided that fast. Oh. It's... They have flamethrower and it's easy. You know? It's easy to come at somebody with flamethrower, you know what I mean? Especially when they got wood on their maze. But in AK, Tommy's, and whatever. I can hear him walking above me. I just gotta catch him off guard. You said they were by gas station, right? Yeah. I don't know where they are now. Okay, I'm looking for them. If you drop one, I can grab a kit and then we can start carving them up. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I'm going by gas station. 
kind of above it. Okay. Can I put another sleeping bag down here? I gotta snag that guy that called me a pussy. Door camping me. I just gotta get close enough to him to where it's gonna hurt when I hit him, you know? Yeah, but three of them are chilling out together, so if you can get That's one I mean. if you can get one in the back then if I get strapped up then that one guy who's left or the two guys that are left are in trouble because they're so they're so relaxed like they just don't think anybody's gonna contest. They're sloppy. So I, I don't see any of them. I'm by a gas station. Yeah, I don't know where are they, they in it. No, they're like on that bus stop. Now they're all standing there looking around. I almost want to go cash out and get some more metal fragments or whatever. That guy, he got roadside. Come out, pussy. I'm like, I have one way out of this building. What you guys have roped off. Okay, see that guy? Let me get serious now. Hold on. Bad to see you. Good thing I got that wood. Two people are dead here. Really? Do you yeah. sibyl one of them? With an S? Torkin says he hates door campers. I agree. I mean, I do it, but like, if you if you're gonna sit there and call me a pussy, come on. It's like, okay, we're gonna leave now. No, you're not. I've played this game for thousands and thousands of hours. I know exactly what I'm getting into. How did they twat? How did they twat? They're not here anymore. I don't know where they went. Are they at our base? Not that I know of. Unless I missed them on the way down. I just don't want to be caught in the open. Is this them right there? Where? Oh no, it's this guy's got a weapon. Where is he? No, uh, it's I'm like out by the outpost. I can't tell who. Looks like oh, a naked okay. boosting a guy who was geared. Oh, yep, he's got a flamethrower. It could be those guys. Where's that at? By the outpost. On my way. Yeah, that like inlet. If you look at my stream, you can see him. Let me look. Guy's just burning the, the top. Outpost, right? Yeah, there's dome. And then that's where this guy is. You can see him burning. Oh, on top. Yeah. Okay. Like a, it's across the river. You go across the land bridge, and it's like on the inlet. Yeah. The one that wraps I in. know where that is. Yeah. Yeah. That's where I killed that guy. Yes. That's them because they got a blowtorch out. They're just trying to get easy money is what they're doing right now. But what I'm going to have to do is... How many of them is there? I, it looks like there's one gear and there's one naked. I don't know if these are the same guys. Well, I'm going to go up top. Should I go up top? 
Yeah, probably. Hey, it looks like he's bugging out. Or he jumped in, I can't tell. I mean, if you have AKs, what are you doing burning doors down? I don't know. That's some weird shit. Maybe they're that bored, you know? Yeah, well. Oh, yeah. You hear somebody jumping, it's me. Uh, I can't hear you over my jumps. Good. Get up there. Uh, Get up there, fat ass. Oh my goodness, I'm back where I started. Fuck me, Jerry. Oh, I hate this mountain. Yeah, it's terrible. It's the worst. I just slid down. Son of a bitch. <gasps> There's a cute guy here. There. Right by me. I uh, jumped on the mountainside. Is he on the mountains? Unless it was you. I am geared. Are you in the valley? Yeah, I'm probably above you. I think somebody jumped down. Are you above? I don't know where you're at. I'm like in right under you. To where I am. A dude dropped down over here for sure. What? There's no that was you. This guy definitely dropped down, right? Are you climbing up this side? I'm already on top. I'm on the tippity top. Yeah, there's a guy that was down here. There he is. I see him. Has my suit guy right here. Oh shit! You'll hear him in a where second. Is he? You'll hear him in a second. Uh, down by the power lines. Oh, he's got a jackhammer. Oh, yeah, fuck this guy up. I got him on oh, the I beach. See him. Yeah, I'm dragging him out for you. I see him. I'm coming behind him. I keep leading him. He threw, did he throw a rock at me for real? What a bitch. Yeah, he's running out in the water now. Ah, oh, hell yeah. Take that, Jacko, baby. What we could do while we're waiting for these guys to figure out where their dicks are at, um, we could build another right, bunker. Can you me, please? Oh, I was gonna put a rocket in down. Hey, Jade. Now we're gonna have company. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I knew there's a guy. Still got, down. Yeah, there's a geared guy over there. What do you say we go farm and put down another small bunk? Oh, all right. They say I farm this gear guy. Yes. The bullets I got left? I'm solid. Was he going? Outpost? Probably. Jackhammer my fucking tits. Ooh, outpost is right here. Ugh. My minute's up anyways. Yeah, you'll see a red thing in the corner now. It says, do you and Razor mainly do? Oh, yeah, each other's mouths. What? There's a guy that ran this way. I'm trying to track him. I think that guy just bought this jackhammer. I think he did. Probably. And he got slept. Yep, the only durability he had was what he put in my back. Yep. Oh, 
Oh yeah. <laughs> he says hot. <laughs> That's fair. Uh. Where did this dude go? Did he completely just run? I think so, or he's inside, I don't know. Oh yeah, daddy, daddy. These guys for real just going around door raiding everybody? Is it the same guys? Oh, I though? see you. I don't know if the the same guys, but where's that Jade? Uh, you see where this one base is? Is I feel like it's like 350 by me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. north in my direction. So if you look at your like 290, 300, see where my dot is? Uh. It's to my right, if you're looking at me. Are that bait? Yeah, yeah, it's like down low. Oh, right shit! Uh, it's right behind me. Glandia? Glandia? Tell me if you kill him, I'll come back and get my shit. Whoa! Where did this guy come from? What the fuck is going on? That guy's on? dead. Coming up to grab some gear. You, uh, I'm trying to give you some backup. I'm coming. I got bags. Oh, I hit him. I'm gonna die. They live in this base. They're coming out. He's coming for his kit. Ah, oh, shit. Guys, yeah, yeah, these are boyfriends right here for sure. The other guy's right where I died. He's down low. Is here I am? No. I had to go grab my shit. Oh, he got the fucking jackhammer, I think. Fuck. I only got 20 bullets. 26 bullets left. Uh, where do you want me? Just let me know if somebody's in this valley. Oh, I really need to know. How weird that guy snuck around the back like that. Yeah, there's one guy coming right where I got shot. He's running across, just taking a look. I think he's looking for you or your kit. Yep, that's him. I'm leaving. Yeah, they're coming out of this base. I got his stuff. Hell yeah. I got his siren stuff. Perfect. Yeah, this guy lives here, so this is his little boyfriend. Perfect. Is there a jackhammer in there by any chance? Nothing I noticed. Yeah. I just got a bunch of gear I'm gonna take back. If you check in that body, he's not there anymore. I shot him twice and he ran away. Yeah, uh, one guy's chasing me. That's the same guy. Is he naked? Yeah. Yeah. He had a bunch of wood, metal. Key locks. I think they were going to build a fob somewhere, so I'm gonna bring this these mats back home. What do you think? Should we push up in the desert and put down a bunker? Just in case yeah, I got a bunker design I wanna put down. Alright, is it like low cost ish? Yeah. That's all I know.
And that guy, the Sar, got slapped. Yeah, he did. He tried to pull up on me. I was like, I'm weak right now, and your boy's running out of ammo. So, I'm gonna kill you, and then hope the boy doesn't come back. I'm going back to the bunker. I got another. I got a sheet metal door too, so I can seal off that one side of up top. Oh, that's perfect. Burnt off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Hell yeah. If we have enough mats in there, I can make a jump up to the roof. I can metal both those walls too right now because I took his metal. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, no, just keep it for upkeep for now. Because what we have metal now is is going to be good enough, I think. Yeah. I mean, if they want to go hard and pop a metal wall to get some scraps, by all means. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, yeah. it's not worth. Not worth at all. Dude, it's like I could feel the conflict coming. And so, like, just mm -hmm. before that, I was at the outpost buying metal fragments, like, with the shit I recycle. Yeah. And, like, that mm -hmm. all just came in handy. But this, da 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 this. <clears throat> Kids keep getting slapped. He said, "Did they change gun sounds in Rust or console?" Rest? No. No, no, no. It's all the, it's all the same. We don't uh, have the recoil this is, Yeah, we didn't have the recoil update, so. This is legacy. How do I get up to the top? How do I get in the base? Oh, did they burn off our jump up? Yep. Nice guys. So I oh, I got, I got it. Don't worry about it. Oh, yeah? Man, I'm just cleaning them up tonight. Cleaning them. Oh, cool, I asked him. Yeah, he pulled the old distraction on that one. That guy at the SAR got slapped. Okay, I better jump up back. It's made out of twigs, so don't worry about it. If you want to make the half wall wood, as long as we can get to it and hack it up with a sword, it's pretty easy to take out. That way, they can at least spend low grade to burn it. The guy, they call the third guy in with an AK as a door campus to say, come out and fight, dude. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> call me a pussy. I'm like, okay, cool. Get slapped. <clears throat> Not my problem, dude. I mean, you cute. Are you coming up? No. Are you coming up? No, I'm not. That's gotta be enemies at the gates. Alright, all metal doors up top now. Hot. I'll come back with some, I'll buy some metal fragments with some of the uh, scrappy poo and I'll come right back. Baby. I got you a kit too. Hell yeah. I got you um, a DB and a SAR. <laughs> Hot. Got you an extra TC too if you need it. Quality. What did this dude have on him? 5k? Ganked him? Man, oh, I had 50 high or low grade. Oh man, he had all types of stuff. Poor guy. Yeah, I want to put that thing on the water so these bitches gotta be floating out every time.
They don't want to. They don't want to know what to do with that shit. One guy will be on the shore. The other two are sitting there going, "We're drowning. We're drowning." Yeah. He said, uh, "Box says custom servers, please." Yeah, I know, right? Won't be for a while, homie. Oh, yeah. Or who knows? I, I mean, I don't really know the answer to that, you know? I'll go in the desert naked, and then I'll go farm some stuff up, and then make a bunker. Man, I slapped the guy who's farming and got his kit. Sign for the other dude. By supermarket. Oh, by yeah. sword. And then I just scooped this guy with a sire. His boy I hit like two or three times, but he ran off. I think he was bleeding out, that's why he left. Well, and then the third guy came in with an AK and shot me from the top of the hill. I was all like trying to give you intel. I know. Yeah, I just like people started to catch on to that now. I'm gonna go ahead and make a box, and then I'm gonna go over by Dome and farm. I don't have enough bullets, so... These guys are so bad, Can't keep though. scooping it's... gear. How do they have a base so shitty and all that gear? Nice to have friends. I mean... Bunch of farm bots, dude. Yeah, I mean, that... The base is trash. Go ahead and put my gear in here. Yeah, I lick your butt. What do you think about that, dog? Don't they stack? Oh, it's hurt just a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna take this pick with me because it's not mine really. There's a bunch of little boxes down here that I placed. Oh, the bunker's gotta be popped open, huh? Eh? Eh? Yeah. I can farm some stuff and just make a bunker over there real quick. It won't take me long. I'm gonna plant a bunch of pumpkins outside, too. I wouldn't put them on the shore. Ah, uh, too late. I forgot about underwater. Uh. Is there a bunch of stone over there? Mm. Depends no. on where, where you're talking about. Desert. I mean, there should be. Okay. Problem is, you're just gonna roast your dick off. Nah, I'm gonna be naked. I have to make us some more pistol rounds for that. Timothy. It's a potato ball, yeah. Mushy mo, smell my butt. Do those guys live in that big base? Which guys? The ones we just fought? Uh, yeah. The one guy does. <laughs> yeah, there's all dog shit bases around here. It's like, just give us a second to get a foothold and we'll shit on all of them. So. Let me get this straight. They came after me after... <laughs> uh, they had their base right there and they still couldn't finish the job? Yeah. My guess uh, is the guy that you slept and I took his gear and his jackhammer, I bet they lived up top. Oh, yeah. And they, they engaged you and shot me and he took his jackhammer back. Dog shit. I think that's what happened. I need to I'm gonna have to get that Timmy skin. Wait, you don't have the tribal one? No, I got the I got the tribal one. I mean, for for my skin. Mow, mow. If they ever offer me a skin. <laughs> I thought you just gonna put some some ropes on there. I could. 
I just want a bunch of like white um Re. splooge on there, Annie. There's no uh, Oh my Does this carpet give me comfort? I'm gonna touch your butt. Maybe you People are passed out in the fishing village. I know. This is garbage. Yeah, I think people are just closing their game. I think it allows them to uh, stay there. Bags of ass. If they close it? Yeah, if you just close the app, I think. Ah. Uh, Gee. What's up, Austin? He says, is this... Legend of Zelda? No. Yes. Cam Dog says, yo, let me join. Sorry, man. No, cargo's not out yet. It's not on PTB yet. Next, or... It should be any time now. Literally. Said they were just, uh... Finishing up testing in their Discord, so... Uh, is it bunking up? Yeah, that's right. <sighs> Cookies and cream, if you know what I mean. Cream, 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 cream in my butt. Is that too direct? Nah, it's just right. He said, "Is this Legend of Zelda?" No. Yes. I'll tell everybody though. If you want it to be. Happy. I don't know why you don't ever come play with this. Static. You need to quit being so shy. Yeah. You remember, you remember playing H1Z1 with that? Mm -hmm. That's so fun. I, I see some stuff. saying so you could do it more. I know you were. That's why I did it more. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Thanks, bitch. All audio is lost. Yes. Yeah, oh, that's cool. Are you gonna queef? Jeez, this guy said I just grubbed a guy for nine turret. Or wait. For a turret, nine cameras, and computers. Ripsky, that guy is pissed. Yeah, he's he's upset. It's a sure. lot of tech trash. For sure, that guy's pissed. He's like, he's pissed, Becky. Pissed, bitch. You want some of me? You want some of me? Yes. I got a feeling those guys are gonna come back with a vengeance to our base. Uh, yeah, hundred percent. Mm -hmm. They're like, uh, you remember that guy that came out with a Tommy and shot at us because we were door camping him? We should go raid that guy. Yeah, what a piece of shit. Yeah. Like, bring some logic, alright, son? Well, there's a ton of boxes by Dome. I might have to snatch his. <laughs> <clears throat> Just use these, this pick to hit barrels and stuff because it's not like it's mine. Hey, buddy. Don't ever, ever shut off your game when you're log. Don't log out. I don't. 
I got you some gears. Perfect. You're perfect. I got your kayak. Oh. Need the loot right now. Because how do you feel about MK players? If they're on PC, then they're fine. But you can't play MK on or for console. It is considered cheating. They inherently have an advantage over controller players every time. They can move a little bit faster. And have snap aim, you know. I mean, don't get me wrong, you know, like I played Rainbow Six Siege on PC and hung with most of the good MK players in the higher ranks, and I was on controller, but still, you know, like. It's considered, yeah, it's considered cheating. You need some good dog. Oh man. Huh? You need some components. Because there is, somebody came over here with a jackhammer recently, because there is no style. Yeah, but they so don't hard. really ban anyone for it, but it's very obvious they're using it. That's why it's up to us as players to report them and clip it. You know what I mean? Base, base, base. You know what I think? Hmm. Nobody is really built by... What's up, Odin? You coming in or what, bitch? Hi, Odin. Something just makes me want to be nice to Odin today. Those guys look like they run oil all the time. Uh, the guys that are harassing us? Ah, uh, there's some by Dome and 220. We gotta sneak some more mats in, so we got that wood. I just brought 5,000 wood. I know, but you know we're gonna burn through it quick. Oh, well, yeah. Before we get pinned right. down again. Should tie this over for a little bit while I'm trying to farm. Dude, somebody just scalped all of the freaking stone off of the desert biome. Oh, I agree yeah. with you, though. Uh, Cam, I get it. You know, it's kind of a pain. But even like the TikTokers that do it and post it, don't get banned. Mm, I, uh, I can't attest that. I can't speak to that because I don't. I've never seen that, so. I have TikTok. Obviously, nobody's That's reporting. That's why it's up it. to everybody to report them. See them on TikTok, report them. It's, if they have video evidence. Okay. Video evidence of people cheating that's specifically obvious, then send uh, Double Eleven the clip in their Discord, man. I touch your butt. Think about that, dog. Our second floor has uh, a garage door and a flip door. Right. I'm I getting get, some, some I get of those, the stones I, spawning back now. If I get those gears, I can make a shotgun traps so that they drop in on our jump up. I got, 
two gears right now. I'll kiss you, bro. Just trying to stay frosty. Somebody just got all this done, dude. Like, literally. How many gears do you have? Only two right now. Like, do right now. So some people stream with MK hand cams. Wow. That I would report. I'm gonna bring what I got over to the base now. These guys not take. I wonder if they took everything out of there. Probably. Oh yeah, the other night. Oh yeah, my bad, dude. Oh, what the hell? You sneaky little shit. A bear just mauled my butt. <laughs> I got a dirty idea. If we leave the door off here and put a shotgun trap aiming, we could probably bait people down. There is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. What, I think the bunker gonna... part? Yeah, like, uh. Yeah, yeah. that's. No, 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 not the bunker part. That's the go-to. Not the bunker part. Up Which part? above. You'll see. If we oh, put it probably, yeah. back here, because everybody expects it to be under. Mm -hmm. So if we have it aiming right here and they drop in blindly, wow. Oh, so the trick is to fake them out. Yeah, if they, uh... Those guys that came by earlier were dog shit. The shout fit shout. They're trying to, trying to gr gr grub us. Oh, Estella. Bye, Estella. You're dead now. The, the Stella. No. They use this as like a peak. We're gonna have to probably place somewhere in the other part of the desert, not the dome place, because that's hot. I think, yeah. I don't like the desert. I don't like living there. Cause it's fucking. Oh, I it's hate living there. Radioactive hot all day, every day. Yeah. Or the winter biome. Winter biome, at least you can make a heater. You can't make an AC unit. That's true. I lick your butt, butt. Did 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 butt, butt. Say what, what, what? Lick that butt. I'm back to the crib, Steven. What's up, off road? What's up, man? Careful, AK oh, scout over here. Oh, there They're popping off shots over here. At you or? 30. They're not at me. Say, damn. I wouldn't blame them. I mean, I would. 
to just wait for them to come out of their gate and spray them down. Oh, I see him. He's on top of that furnace. I want to. I want to clap him so bad. Yes. Bringing a uh, gear home. What's up, Austin? Are you walking in? Yeah. Check this shit out. Hey, boy. Yeah, I got What's another up? box in there. Play boy. Look at this shit. Yeah. If we put uh. up here, you need to off on these two or punch them in. Oh, yeah, daddy. Oh, yeah, daddy. Oh. Got you some, uh. That needs to go. In this box? Why am I hot? Furnaces. Mats. I had a mad fight with a guy, but in the end, I killed him with a scrapper and upgraded to an ASP and a Gorgon. He think he might be mad. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, I bet he loved it. That guy is salty. Salty. I'd be pissed. We could probably just stick it on the roof, too, and just have it aiming right at that fucking pit. The trick is, we're gonna have to have a place to stash some loot once we kill these dudes. So they're gonna blow yeah. the shit out of Is there a furnace running over there or no? Over where? At their base, do you know? I do not know offhand. If they're cooking furnace, I can assume that they're coming for us. I didn't see one, so I don't wanna oh, say yeah. yes. Do you wanna touch my cheeks? Do you wanna lick my butt? Hey, ass how? Bunker. Actually, I could probably put that down. He won't be mad about that. We can always move it too. Hey, follow me. I need you off and on this. Hold on one second. Uh, hey, my inventory is full. Hey, do you got those gears down there somewhere? There is. Uh, I will in two minutes. Trying to organize. Hey, I need to craft. Can you place it somewhere? It's in the upper left hand box. Thanks, dog. Hey, can you do me a favor and make some handmade shells? Yeah. What's up, Silver? So he says, when's cargo, babe? Whatever you want it to be. Those guys are annoying. Oh yeah, they're. Can't yeah, wait to get rid of them. Yeah, me too. Need to hand me each other now. 
That actually might be too tall for that, huh? Razor, can you look at my stream? What do you think about that placement? That way we can still get up and hopefully they don't see it when they come in. Um. Let's see. What's up, killer? Diagonally Stay off to the side? Yeah. You mean? Yeah, a little bit. But it sh I want it to point to the seam in the back so they get their shit blown up. Yeah, that should be fine. I just hear you place it. You got your kayak in here too. I feel like that's too far over. Shit. Well, do you want me to simulate me walking in? Uh. Probably help you better visualize. Nah, no, I've. They dropped to the right or the left here. No, they're fucking dead either way. No, it needs to be pivoted just to sconch. Damn it. Hopefully we can bait them in. Yeah, I just hope we have enough to like seal if they start blowing hard. Yeah. Low. <laughs> Blow dicks, you feel me, dog? Anyway. Okay, there. Right, I'm just organizing so I know where all the crap is when I go to grab it. What are those idiots doing over there? I don't know. They're so dumb. They don't fucking murder anybody that drops in. Yeah, you drop. Yeah, this will fucking kill you. No doubt. What's up, killer? What's up, killer Kane? It's been a hot minute, you dirty little yeah, man. Dude. In a while. You gotta take the That's vid smoke right. job, man. So, what's up, B? For real stuff. Got them handmaids. No. Gotta cook uh, sulfur. Richard, I just emptied this one. How much stuff do you have on here? Uh, I just was emptying it, so... Okay. You got metal in there? Yeah, I put it inside the TC. No, like, in this furnace. Okay. Yeah, I put it back. There's 125 sulfur in this box over here. I'll lick your butt. Took all the equipment out of the boxes. Base, base, base cannon, base cannon. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, that's not how you play Dance Dance Furnaces. You know how to be upset? He 
these guys are gonna come and finger our asses so hard. They are. I'm gonna go get more stone, dude, because we need to get that honeycomb stone. Yes. Well, I mean, we got metal on the outside. We need wood and stone. We need it all. Hey, did you get those doors up top? You're gonna need them. Yeah, I got the... I got the garage door. And the uh, swing door on top? I didn't get that one. For real stuff. Hey, good news is we didn't have to farm up the level two. <laughs> stone and wood. Or the guns. Yeah, stone. Yeah, that's true. Stone and wood. And metal if you got it, but stone and wood. I'll go get stone first. Metal. I see it. I mean, I don't really care if I die at this point. I only got, I got a dead man's pick, you know. The skin off of my back. People still can't believe that I go out farming naked. I'm like, Phew. hey, I can't believe. Like people if I go out with nothing and I come out with something, then I win. If I go out with nothing on farm and somebody kills me. Then really, I didn't lose anything besides time. I'd rather lose time than maths. That's just me, though. You see how we can stand back in that airlock with the single doors and like look into that one door, and I can I can get in there acting like I'm going to the top, let them kill me. Yeah. And hopefully we can bait them down. Yeah, when you kill that yeah, one guy, while they're looking at you, and they come in and get smoked, then you can come out and close that door. Yeah. Get ripped, bitch. Clappity clap, 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 clap. I always like new wipes, because the beginning is always so dicey. Oh, we only have like 10 rounds in that <laughs> shotgun trap. Two rounds, uh, oh, two or three 16. rounds to kill the geared guy. 16 rounds. You know, it's funny because the shotgun trap actually slaps. People just don't realize how bad it hurts when they walk right into it. You getting rocketed, boy? Oh, we're getting rocketed. You're getting rocketed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Or is an H one? Or is an HV? I don't know. An HV. Let me come look what they're doing. Now nah, I'll take a look. Oh, they're probably. I don't got anything besides picking some stuff. That's I'm, good. I'm, I'm good. I'll come look. I'm all right. I'm all right. I got it. I just want to see how many there is. Yeah, it's an HV. I can see it. Yeah, they're trying to melt the wood to get to the metal. Or see what's under there. <laughs> Who shoots yeah, HPs? It, yeah, it's an HP. Fucking twat. You guys are too dumb to have fucking HVs or even rockets, dude. I'm amazed. I'm truly mystified. Are they still walking around the base? No, no, no. Where did he hmm. come from? I don't know. He came and shot the wooden honeycomb. <laughs> then they ran off.
goes this. Who does that? I mean, we would. <laughs> Man. Thirsty boys. We're gonna need a lot of wood, dude. I, I, I just, I know that's gonna be the one that's gonna catch us off guard. Yeah, yeah. I know we got a lot, but it's gonna go quick. Well, it's just hard because... Why? I got a dome real quick. Oh my goodness, you're dead. What's up, baby? Cause that, Bring I hear, that bow and arrow. Cause I hear those land or those water crops twi taste twice as good as the land crops. Yeah. One, two, three, four, look at twat. with me too. I don't right. get anything at dumb, I'll pack up some stuff. You wanna pop them tanks for real stuff. We have forty rounds. Yeah. We got that buckshot. Butt shot? Or slugs? No? Uh I might. Nope, I just have red and incendies learned. I'm in the box, but all right. Here, get that top door, you fool. It is. Yeah, the swing door. Yeah, I already did. Yeah. Yep. Look at you, you little butts. I move quick. I move. Oh, Zoe, what? Is up? Girl. Like time to see. Hope you're doing good. Let's see, um, hot, these guys hot. are bad. They are bad. That's why I want to just get a little bit of a foot so we can push back. I know. They're trying to bring that constant heat. You know what I mean? Yeah, we're better than. They're that. trying to bring the heat. Better than there. Pipe's going good. We just started like a couple a couple hours ago, so already killed a bunch of gear dudes. Easy clap. Absolutely terrible. The base looks like a dumb game of Tetris. Ah. Uh. Oh man, dude. Ugh. Yeah. Got your little, right. got your little bean bags out. Ah. Uh. Of the belt. That's, that's the only way to fly. I'll get some wood over here after I scale the dome. Yeah, you will. Uh. These guys come up. It's gonna be real bad for them because I got dragon's breath rounds. I'll shoot it on the catwalk and burn them alive. Shoot it I'll everywhere. make them jump off. Somebody's been here.
Upgrades. I'm trying to get springs and stuff so we can make weapons. Need those because we need to be able to bounce back if these guys come hard in the paint. Hide than a twat, hide than a twat, 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 bait, bait. I just want to get enough ladders. Yeah, I know, right? Do you want me to yeah, upgrade, nice. you want me nice upgrade the outside, dog? Huh? I'll upgrade the outside, honey, come down. Okay. This, she said, nice, I've been on a monthly since wife. Nice. That'll come. Just respawning, so somebody's gonna be come here, coming here because they got it on timer guarantee. Yep. The camera? They threw loot on that dude. They threw a high quality. Idiots. They threw a. Um, I quality helmet on the ground. Why wouldn't you just go and freaking scrap that? Like a metal helmet? Yeah. Uh, what should we call it? Um, the heavy. Really? Wow. Maybe they were yeah. pressed to uh. To leave? Yeah. This razor will later you up for playing some. Yeah. Don't talk like that. Yeah. After I get the base secure. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah done it. Yeah. One ounce of blood. I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna get this wood over here. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna sus. Yeah. You're sussy wussy. Shut your mouth. Shushy wussy bitch. Yeah, wood's, wood's gonna be an issue fast. So your butt up, but donkey. Sassy wussy butt. Look, it says, Hi, mommy. Hey, bitch. <laughs> What's up, baby? How many people do you got rolling in your squad, uh, Zoe? Shot the main. Oh, 
Alright, I'll bring like 4K wood home, okay? Well, okay. That was a hot box right there. Thank you. Stop that, that beep beep beep. Is cargo on a P What's up, Marshall? Uh, it is not yet. It's supposed to be sometime this week, so get ready for it, baby. Baby, let's see that butt, 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 butt. Quite like a tiger, you know? Tight like a butt. Tight like a big old butt. Big old juicy butt. <laughs> but. It'll be sometime this week, man. Oh, It'll yeah. be dope. And it'll be coming everywhere. Huh? Are you a coomer? Are you? Yeah. That's all I know. There's a geared guy going up the freaking dome right now. Of course. And I got loot on me. With the rim shot, man. Well, we upgraded this a lot quicker than I thought we needed to. Well, initially. I think we need to. Hooker door. Dave, can you meet me by dome so I can give you this stuff and get this guy's kit? Yeah, come on. I mean, I got a DB and a crossbow, but I could get them. I mean, yeah, yeah, I'll, c I'll come over there. I'll coon. Yep, he's getting to the top now. It's gonna take me a minute to get across the water. That's fine. He's just reaching the top now, he's looking. Where am I meeting you? Um... <sighs> well, like... Oh, dome is the center, like 20 or something. Did I aggro him? I did. Who did you aggro? Freaking scientist. Uh, I'll come over to the beach. I'm trying to take note where this guy's coming down at. Is a wolf in the water? You gotta be kidding me, dude. Get out of here. I'll meet you by the end of the river over here. Do you want a fat kiss in your mouth? Sometimes I like to sit on the prickly. I see him. I'm gonna have to follow him. Just drop it in the river at the end. I'll find it. I see it, yep. 
<laughs> I see you just throwing shit in the river. <laughs> yeah. It's all in there. Engage. Or if I can get this guy. Got a crossy, so it might be a little harder. I think I got it all. Okay. Go now, post a grind. Oh, I up. see him now. Probably gonna buy some more metal too. Yeah. Because yeah, we don't need a lot of. We don't have to research a whole lot, you know what I mean? Might as well use that scrap. This guy's. Oh, pussy, I think pussy. he's going to outpost, but I'm going to stalk him. Okay. Do it, Biss. Because he's. He's kitted. He's got a weapon. If we can go for kill 5 today. Hey. Are you next to the road? I am right on that on the road, yeah. Okay. The road for by outpost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. uh. I'm wearing a high smart suit now, bitch. And a bam bam, bust my nut. Uh, say bust, say bust, say what? Bust the bus, they bust, 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 bust. Say what? Mm. I'm talking about balls, dream. Two has my guys in the uh high post grinding. Mm hmm What does this guy have out? A jackies? Oh he bought a jackhammer. Oh. Uh I don't know, Brent. I don't know. He's going to farm, dude. going to farm right now. Grinding up all the tech trash for now, just because we got these guys up our ass. I only give them tech trash for T4. Nah, if we can help it, that. Got him. Oh my goodness. Lots of shit. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh. I just scooped some loot. He has like almost 2,000 low grade on him. Jeez. Two thousand low grade, twenty five high qual, three hundred metal, six hundred fifty sulfur, DB, the Jackies. Oh my! <laughs> that guy's Scoop signing out. Loot. He's signing out for the night after that. Shift gun. Wolf is on my nuts. Can you still get? Oh my god. Stop, girl. This wolf is on my nuts. I gotta go to the outpost real quick. Scoot loot. Hey guys. Pissed. I've got a red thing, so I'm good to go in there, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Should be good. I just bagged some loot from that kid. Jeez, man. That guy just lost everything. What's up, dog? Good at it. Here. Come here. Wait. Hold on. Let's go over here. I got like a row and a quarter. I got two things, yeah. Put this up just in case one of us gets waxed. Got yeah, ya. Yeah. What else you got? Blow guy? What an idiot, huh? <laughs> what a <laughs> dummy. Yeah, let's go. I gotta go grind up these go back to me. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm gonna make uh, the, the most out of my I'll setup. I'll wait out here for you. Thank you. Uh, oh. Who runs around with that much low grade? I don't know. A dummy? So here's the plan. Since we don't have to research too much here, I'm going to buy a bunch of metal, big dick style, mm. uh, so we can upgrade some of the base, like the airlock part. Yeah. Uh, see what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, yeah. Double barrel, bitch. There's people just grinding scrap everywhere. What's up? Need uh, to kill these dudes. Brent said uh, he put in there seven months. Yay me. Yeah, man. I appreciate that support, sir. Appreciate you. 2,000 low grade, dude. We just... <sighs> Rigs. Guys, man. Alright, I'm out here. Let's go. Yeah, let me make some bondages. Okay, let's go. Oh, yeah, daddy. Oh, yeah, daddy. My balls. I'm gonna start hunting the grubs that keep coming out of there. Or going in there. Oh. Yeah. That's what, two Jackies? Yeah, hey, let's try it out. Oh, the other one got stolen, right? The other one got stolen? I can't remember. Yeah, it did. The guy shot us back. Do you know what that guy's name was? Uh, I didn't check. I grabbed it and ran because I didn't want him to come back. I do know it's going to be probably, it probably won't have a name after tonight. Probably log out. Balls, dude. 
hot. Oh, balls deep. <laughs> How do we have full inventories? Oh, uh, yeah. I did. This guy had low, gra low grade, high quality, and metal. Perfect. Uh, as you can see, the honeycomb, when you pull up, pull up, is now stone. I mean, because our sham is over. They know what's inside, so we might as well yeah. make it stone. Save the wood. Dude, I've been going out with some garbage here. Coming out paid. Yeah. My balls ache for you. <laughs> what I mean, dog? Yeah. For real, though. For real, though. That guy earlier quit upgrading. <laughs> All right, yeah. Why? Yeah. Okay, come on in. It's your base made out of dog shit. Balls, 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 ball, ball, balls. Greasy dicks. Easy. Got another hazy, another weapon. Jeez. These guys, man, they're really good. They're like, really good at the game. Yeah. I yeah, mean, dog. They definitely got dome on a timer. I'm gonna go scoop some more dudes out of uh, outpost, dude. Scoop some dudes, bud. Gonna lie to you. Yep. Uh oh. Juicy butt. You should just make the honeycomb metal too, and be like, "Hey, hope you have a lot of rackets." We don't have that kind of money yet. I'm gonna get it. What we should do is all rig. Hot box. It happens when people let their guard down, they get all comfortable, they're like, hey man, we're part of this alliance. Nobody can mess with us, and I just come through and I was like, what the hell's an alliance? And then I just clap them cheeks. Hey, what does the fucking, what does the double barrel do? Yeah. What does it do if I hit this trigger twice again? Oh yeah. He did. But, 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 but. Oh. We got two furnaces and we're staying alive, dude, just barely. <laughs> two small furnaces, regular ass of furnaces, barely any guns. Who's this leader guy? Where? Huh?
there's somebody by the base? Yeah. Oh, okay. Box. 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 Give me a break now. Go. Box. 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 I can't do that command. Yes, you can, bitch. You want some med pads, asshole? Some what? Nothing. Jump in. Easy claps. Should go up to that mountain top again to see if that guy got more of his stuff. AK going up over here. Is it really? Yeah. Oh yeah. In that base, are they firing a lot or no? Uh, it's one shot. Sounds like they're over by the station of the soup sperm cat. Should I try to grab them? It's up to you, Donald. The I can grab them for sure. Do you want to be tall? I mean, AK is not that consistent, so I'm not scared of an AK. Scared of you, though. You got that hooker box. I love that. I love that we refer to that as the hooker box. Are you picking pumpkins? No. Someone in a scuba tank is picking our pumpkins. Right now? Yep. I can hear them. I'm gonna go out with the fucking sword and cut them up. I'll be right back. Fuck this guy up. He chased him on the land. I'm almost there, so... I just gotta cross the dirty bridge. Oh, there's two of them. Two people? Yep. A little fucking twat. What do they have? Just they're naked. They're naked? Yeah, and they got scuba equipment on, they just picked all our crops. Well that's unfortunate. I didn't even make it all the way to the Okay. They had scuba flippers on, so they picked everything and then ran. Oh, biatches, huh? Mm hmm There's two of them, dude. <laughs> it's kind of funny, though. Uh oh, geared guy in the rock looking around. Oh wait, no, it's not. It's naked. Where is he at on top? He's on the on beach. On top of a. He's on the beach by you. Yeah, he's, he's saying something. I don't know what he's saying. Tower or fishing? Fishing. Okay. Desert fishing? I don't know. It, it's a naked. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna buzz on your face. I 
Ah. Sad die. Blow it up. I'm in trouble. Yeah. Yo, bitch. Guys trying to clap me. Wow. I'm gonna definitely have to get this guy's gamer tag. That's your gamer tag. I can hear him to your mind. Yeah. yeah, I know. Sorry. What's up, Phillips? What's up, baby? Oh my gosh, hit it. Can you do me a favor, Jade? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can you look up Cassandra on the server and look at the gamer tag and take a screenshot of it for me, please? Okay. I don't see it. Chris? Christine? Pat Calandra? Patrice? I don't see Cassandra, homie. I do not see such things. Calandra. Calandra? 
Yeah, Carl Andrew. Yeah. Two, five, three, nine. This is interesting. I kill him. I shot the guy in the face. Yeah. Okay, you got it? Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm sending that to... <coughs> D... D11, he was saying some uh, pretty bad stuff, so... Time code your stream and then reference blink and then reference the time code. Yep, yep. I don't think they were going to give me the base. I think that was just a trap. Looks like kids listening to a wild, wild music and whatever. I don't think he was actually serious. I mean, I'm going to go to his gates and then try to... Should I get out of party to go talk to this kid? I don't know. What's the game plan for the rest here? I think we got a pretty good lockdown. I'm probably going to seal up the base unless uh, we're going back and forth. As long as the base is locked, we're good. Daddy. They're not getting off the server, they're full of it. It's a guy at the AK. Get us saying some wild stuff. I'm, I'm good on that. Ah. Take it off the server, good. Well, I was thinking about trash. wrapping it up here. So you want me to seal up the base? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can seal it up. I'll wrap it up too. I, uh, I know you're done. No, you don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Psycho. What am I? What am I doing? No. <laughs> what made you think I would do, do you that? you need to drop anything off of the base? No, um, I died in their base. Excellent. Alright, sealing up the base. Alright chat, be sure to drop a like if you did enjoy it. Um, I'd say we made some headway, we'll see if we're rated uh, when we sign in later. Probably. I, I bet you we get rated. Yeah. Hey, but it happens to Alright chat. I'm out to see you guys uh, tomorrow. I will see you guys tomorrow. Everybody. Good night. Have a good rest of your weekend. Okay, good. I did close it. I know when you're. Player. <laughs>